game start. I like how every Steam game just starts with just starts with that. It started in full screen. Uh oh. Uh oh. Quick, what's the hotkey for for Windows mode? <laughs> oh shit. Oh wow. Wow, it supports the Switch Pro controller? Crazy. That's playing an intro, but I can't, uh... Whoa! Okay, hold on. <clears throat> there it is. <laughs> no, I didn't mean to. Uh, no, I wanted to watch more of that. Ah, uh, fuck. No, give me the back. Okay. Okay, okay. Give me a second. Windowed. 4K resolution. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh. Seven twenty. Seven sixty. Nine hundred. Ten eighty. Two K. Nah, no, it's 900, 900, that's fine. <laughs> I don't know what that looked like on the stream because it covered both of my monitors. There we go, it's playing in windowed mode. Music is already adjusted nicely. I'm not gonna fuck with key bindings. Uh, it does have controller support, right? Yeah, 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 there we go. Spell card animation. I can't play 4K because I can't see it. <laughs> uh. It looks okay to me, I think. Let me just... Okay. Diary. Key bindings. Definitely don't want to mess around with this, because I don't know what the game is even going to want me to do with them. Okay. Alright. Alright, are we ready? Yes. There's DLC. Do I... Do I click Ruma? She's floating. Huh. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Alright. Enough looking at the, the, the title screen. It's very nice, though. It's very nice. Let's start. Damn. Look at them tricks. <laughs> Ha. Huh. New recipe available. Skewer. Okay, I need to be careful because A is skip and B is continue. I, it's fucking backwards, but alright. I'll deal. Ha. Huh. Oh, yeah, I had a good night's sleep. Time to start preparing for tonight's work. Ha. Huh. She's not here yet. It's Kyoko. Press on Lester to hide dialogues. Soft. Thank you, Phoenix, for the resub. Well, what's wrong? Here, have some water and take a break. Ah, it's nothing. I was short of breath because I ran all the way here. Sorry for being late again. It's pretty windy today. And the chief priest just wouldn't let me go until I swept away all the fallen leaves. So, <laughs> Wow, that must have been hard. Why don't you just take it easy today? I'll take care of the prep work myself. No, it's fine. Please let me help you. Is it really fine? Don't overwork yourself. It's really fine. And tonight is the night of the showdown. How can I desert you at a moment like this? Thank you, Kyoko. Okay, then let's start preparing ingredients for tonight's izakaya. Ooh, tricks. <laughs> what, a, what a first customer. I'm starving. Here it comes. Is she the one? Hungry. Misty, she looks kind of weird. Oh, yo, Kyoko's an employee? Look at that. Everyone is counting on me. If I mess up now, Misty, I'm so hungry. Doesn't matter how scary she seems right now, she's just a starving guest. As long as she's my guest, I have one job. 
The purpose of a cook is to serve and satisfy the stomachs of hungry guests. You're right. I'm not backing down either. Dear guest, here's the menu. We are ready to open. You can order anything you like. <laughs> Miso soup. Gotcha, I'm on it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down. I can't, can't do all this at once. Use left stick to walk near the correct kitchenware. For miso soup, it should be the pot. Press the interact button while the kitchenware is highlighted to open the cooking panel. Okay. Oh, okay. Hey, how you doing? And interact with B. Alright. Mistia, Mistia walks out of her own business. Prepares to strike. <laughs> Krusty Krab unfair. Mistia is in there. Wait. Why do I have a picture of Yiko on the wall? Huh. I assume that's Yiko. Oh shit. Okay. Uh recipes from the daily menu will appear in the recipe section of the corresponding kitchenware. Press the select button to automatically place the ingredients needed for the highlighted recipe into the ingredient section. What's the select button? Super common in izakayas when seaweed first appeared in Gensokyo. Someone tried boiling it and discovered that it was very savory. Since then, it's been popular all across Gensokyo. It's vegetarian, home cooking, soup, inexpensive, and not greasy. Or is, is it greasy? I assume the X means it's not greasy. Uh... Seaweed, a kind of ingredient comes from nowhere, but they seem to become very common here now. Hmm. Okay. I, I feel like the text could be positioned in a better way than it is. And I'll, you know, just a little bit. Select ingredient, remove ingredient. If other cuisine also use ingredients, they will appear in the output section. Okay, boiling pot. It'll take some time to cook. Wait till the food is done. This is gonna take me a little bit to figure out, that's for sure. Retrieval, retrieve the finished cuisine from the kitchenware and transfer it to the tray. Don't forget the drink, go take it from the wine rack. Press the retrieve button to obtain the corresponding drink from the wine rack and transfer it to the tray as well. Currently you can store two cuisines in a beverage or tray. Most common drink for the weak yokai who can't even take a single drop of alcohol. No alco in that. Mm -hmm. Press the exit button to close the menu. I don't think I put it in the tray, did I? I guess I did. Now head to the customer and serve them their meal. Isn't that Kyoko's job? The meal you prepared and store it in the tray. Press the cuisine and beverage to serve them to the customer. Usually the customer will rate the meal after it's served, but this one's a bit odd. Use the return button to exit. No matter what I have, I cannot fill my stomach. Damn. Dear guests, hope you enjoy the meal. Grilled lamprey. Th this is truly terrifying. She gulped it all down the instant I brought it to her. Lampreys are my signature dish. I'll get it done in no time. Hmm. Guest orders will show up here. Give them what they ordered and you will get the corresponding positive rating. Otherwise, you may anger the customer. No problem. Okay, so you need tea. Okay. One of Mistia's signature dishes. I wanted to break the stereotype that restaurants at Red Lanterns all sell grilled birds. Do you know that lamprey can effectively treat night blindness? They used to be a rare delicacy. It's aquatic signature barbecued. It's not meat, but it's not vegetarian. Well, because it's a fish, right? Fish is in that... Fish is in that weird gray zone, I guess. Give them what they ordered. Okay. A kind of migratory fish, but somehow can be found in the rivers and lakes of Gensokyo. A bit rare. Rare, huh? It's on the grill. Okay. Uh, yes. Take. No matter what I have, I cannot fill my stomach. Energy kebab. I stared at her the whole time and only managed to get a glimpse of a brief after image of her eating the food. Is this the power that transcends all common sense? Look, I don't care what she does as long as she pays. It seems like you're really starving. May I take your order again? 
Okay. Common beef from the cattles in human village. Common onions in human village. Common pumpkin in human village. A skewer made of beef, onion, and pumpkin. The onion's tartness and pumpkin sweetness mitigates the greasy beef, giving the skewer a refreshing taste. Not vegetarian. Barbecued meat filling. Okay, I see. So I can select the ingredients manually, or I can just select from the recipe and immediately put the ingredients in. And I can get the tea ahead of time. Okay. <clears throat> Woo! I see the little bar. Okay. I cannot fill my stomach. Daimyo's feast! As expected, she instantly finished it again. Okay, coming up. Sashimi platter. Eh? Beef Wellington! Dear guest, I can't keep all those orders so- if you- I can't keep up with your orders so much at the same time. Ino Shikacho. Dear guest! Don't eat me. What are you doing? Misty, get out of there! <laughs> ah! God damn it. She's got hungry ghosts. She's got fish bones stuck out of her mouth. She's got so many forks. Run! Retreat! Eat it! Eat it all! What in the world is happening? Consume. Misty, stay with me! Stay with me! Oh shit! What, is she back? No, take a closer look. That's somebody else here. So it didn't work this time either. Misty, I think we met this guest somewhere before? Ah! You! You are... Uh, I messed up. I've come so far, yet everything I've got... Gensokyo and everybody... Sorry. I... Ruined by you, Yuko. You failed again. This mission seems too difficult for you. I'm terribly sorry, but you're the only one who could... I just want to ask you one question. Do you want to give up? I... But I have nothing left. Misty. While originally anything we say and do right now would have been meaningless because it's already too late. However, with the combined power of myself and that person, not all is lost. What did you say? I'm the history-eating half-beast. As long as I'm here, you can always start over from scratch. As long as you don't want to give up, I'll be happy to give you a hand no matter how many times. People are trusting me and totally depending on me. I don't... I don't want to give up. I won't let it end like this. As expected, no matter how many times this happened, you would always make the same choice. Huh? You're right. It's too early to give up. The road to reincarnation may be difficult, but you must be determined and ready for the challenges ahead. This token may be of help to you in the future. Take good care of it. Reincarnation. Ichijo's returning bridge. This is... Ugh. My consciousness. May luck be ever in your favor. You're Gensokyo's only hope. I have... No. We have faith in you. Well, that's kind of weird. Making some... Whoa! What? New... Whoa! Okay, alright. We're doing it again. Alright, playing the feud. Mmm... Uh... No! Don't! What a weird dream. It was just a dream, right? Feels a bit too real. And there was somebody in the dream. Nope! Can't remember what they look like. What was it about again? Mm, why am I holding a gingo leaf? Did it fly in here while I was asleep? I have a feeling that this is something important, but why? Whatever, I give up. Shouldn't really try to remember details in a forgotten dream. I am a bird brain, after all. Oh, I slept well. Of course, it would be great if Baezakaya was as big as the one in my dream. Uh, but I vaguely remember it was destroyed by someone in the end. Uh, I need to stop. It's time to start preparing for tonight's Isakaya. <laughs> this is great. Look at this. Oh, this is fantastic. <laughs> oh, the art in this game is fucking phenomenal, dude. 
My name is Mistia. I'm one of the weakest yokai that you can encounter in the mysterious world of Gensokyo. I love singing and grilling lampreys, and I also open an izakaya, izakaya in my spare time. What? Forget about singing. It's super weird to call grilled lampreys as a hobby. What? Do I have to grill birds instead? That would be really, that would really be weird. People treated lampreys as a delicacy in the past. It's definitely more delicious. Not to mention that it also prevents night blindness. An ingredient that tastes great and also has health benefits? What more could you ask for? Phew, take a step back. I feel totally energetic today. Traveling the Yokai Trail. Am I? Not quite. I'm in the Sparrow Hut. Achievement unlocked. A horrible nightmare. Green tea. Cuisines. Ingredients. Fresh tofu, an appetizer of cooling off in the summer. Simple and refreshing. Kitchenware. A common pot crafted with ancient Chinese pottery and accumulates heat well. It can pressurize ingredients within and boil them efficiently. A very handy kitchenware indeed. A common grill? Its mesh surface conducts heat to food quickly when lighted. Now you can enjoy the taste of the wild. Supposedly it can put a smile on every dad's face. <laughs> With enough oil, this baby can deep fry anything and everything. The finished product is always delicious and crispy. Watch your cholesterol, though. Shh. A steamer, not not a steamer, is a revolutionary technology. It can cook several layers of food while keeping most nutrition. A brilliant choice for those who want to be healthy. Cutting board, the go-to choice for cold plates. Handy tool for raw fish, raw meat, or salad. It can preserve the ingredients' original taste. No items. Misty's guitar is here. It's a nice acoustic guitar. So the freezer and the shelf are the same. Okay. Hmm. Traveling the Yokai Trail. No, I want to go into Mistia's basement. Her her tree basement. Night Sparrow outfit. Mistia's usually clothes can wear in front of uh, the closet at her home. Mistia's wearing clothes can wear in front of the closet at home. Wear at work. So you can... Well, I want to wear the... Yeah, I want to wear it at work. Record player. Play this tune in the Izakaya. Yo! Yeah! <laughs> Nothing here. Go socialize and be more friends. Okay. Oh shit, what's this art? Oh, there's so many! Oh god! I I can't I can't be digging through there. I can't be digging through there. There's 22 pages of that, dude. If I go through that, that's gonna be like 10, 20 minutes. Let's go to the Yokai Trail. That's a nice house. Did something happen here right here? <laughs> Give me that! Giving me those puppy eyes after owing me so much money, I. <laughs> Excuse me, what is this? <laughs> Why did she have a nail pad, dude? I have no mercy for you. <laughs> it's not like I don't want to pay. It's just that your interest rate is way too high, really. Please, I beg you, give me one more week. I'll do whatever I can to get money. I... Do I look like I care? You know what? I know it. Today's the date, the deadline, the finale. If you can't pay, then you really shouldn't blame me for... <laughs> it's nothing personal, kiddo. <laughs> How could this happen? Ah, uh, isn't this Kyoko? Stop right there. <laughs> Why is Chen gonna break her kneecaps? Misty, Kyoko, are you all right? I, she owes my family money, and she already passed too. You, you mind your own business. Kyoko's my friend, her business is my business. Misty, I then if you insist, then why don't you pay your debt for her? No problem, just tell me how much, I'll pay. No, Misty, I don't want to drag you into this. I'm ready for the consequences. Misty, this is none of your business. Don't underestimate her, and don't foolishly get involved with her like I did. 
It's fine, how much money can you possibly owe? Well, at least I have a business, plus some savings, too. Leave this to me. Name your price. How much did she owe you? I like you already. How straightforward. It's not much. 3,000 yen in total, including interest. That much? It wasn't that much at first, but the interest started stacking on top of itself, and... Damn it. What? Why? Didn't you say you'd pay? I'm just a little short. Ah, oh, you were just faking it. Um... Misty, it's all right. Seeing your face and how you're trying to help before I lose my kneecaps. I have no regret in life. <laughs> I went into debt because I was too native back then. I'm ready to face... You mean naive? <laughs> I'm ready to face the consequences of my own stupidity. <laughs> how are you going to face this? Could you just give us a little extension? Nope, I told you I want the money. And I want it today. Then how about this? Can I borrow money from you to pay for Kyoko's debts? <laughs> Misty, you can't do this! You're trying to borrow debt to pay debt! Not only would it make you in debt, indebted, the snowball will keep rolling bigger and bigger! Until there's no way out! There's no other way right now. Don't worry, I run a business and I won't go down without a fight. <laughs> but, we can't care about all that right now. So how about my proposal? She wouldn't be able to pay the debts no matter how even before, sir. My offer should be more tempting for you. Phew. All according to plan. What did you just say? Ah, never mind. Sure, I'll take your proposal. Then, I'll sign this loan agreement. Kyoko Kasadani's debts would be erased. Then you'll be a new debtor. Contract. Misty Lorelei borrower now owes 3,000 yen to Yakumo Family Bank lender due next month if from... If borrower defaults, then lender can break borrower's kneecaps. That, wow, it's a hell of an agreement. What a what a contract that one is, huh? Huh? Why do you have a second loan agreement ready beforehand? You you shouldn't worry about the details. Just sign it now. But, but, what what? You're not going back on your word, are you? No, it's I I'm illiterate. A handprint would also work. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry, I've got you into trouble. Don't say that. That's what friends do. You do the same to me. I can't let you do all this by yourself. Let me help. Of course. Don't you dare run away. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Alright. Let's get on with it. I don't know why, but I feel kind of dizzy. I've completely forgotten my routine. Anyway, my izakaya doesn't open until 6 p.m. at night, so I can get some preparations done during the day. Let's get first get my mind straight. I should still have some leftover ingredients. First, let's check what's left. Hmm, there's these. There's this, these, and those. It's enough for simple dishes, but it would be nice to have as many ingredients as possible. <clears throat> these places are kind of suspicious, aren't they? You can find some decent stuff if you investigate them. It feels like merely collecting ingredients doesn't provide enough stock. You can also buy ingredients from the merchant during the day. However, it seems like the merchant is restocking. Maybe it'll be a few days before he comes back. At least for now, I'll have to collect ingredients all by myself. And this is how I check my ingredients inventory. Everything will be stored in here and I can check my inventory any time of day. Here you can switch to different categories, food, ingredients, beverages, kitchenware, and other objects. Trout, Pisces fish, and habits in fresh water, rather common. Okay, and here you can view all the contents under each category, and this is where you'll see the detailed descriptions. Because you can check these at any time, there's no need to memorize them all, just open the tab when you need to. Now I have to mention my notes, which contain all of my Izakaya's trade secrets, you can view them here. First, these are my stats, my portrait. <laughs> it's pretty cute, isn't it? The proprietress, Misty Lorelei, the Night Sparrow, incredible, inedible bird, indebted singer. Initial vibe, zero. Base tip rate, zero. Wow. <laughs> what is that? In initial vibe? Money! It's the most important thing. Without enough of it, horrific things might happen when I have to pay my debt. Level, which increases the more I work. The higher the level, the more perks I'll gain. I really can feel my progress every step along the way. This page is all the recipes I've learned. Check it out here. If you forget how to make a certain dish, feel free to flip through it at any time. And here's the to-do list. It would be terrible if I promised someone to do something by a certain date, but didn't complete it on time. 
Let's say burb brain. That says burb brain. So you must always, always, always check this often. I repeated it three times because it's important. As for these, since there's not much here yet, I'll explain it later. This notebook holds all of my trade secrets. While they may seem petty, jotting them down is one of my favorite hobbies. And I have this feeling, if one day I can fill the entire notebook, I would definitely be considered a very competent chef and business owner by then. I look forward to that day. Of course, time is also important. The Knight's Berry Zakaya serves guests during the night. So I'm free to hang around, collect the ingredients, and do whatever I want before 18 o'clock. That's 6 p.m. in military time. <clears throat> Most actions, including collecting ingredients, will take 30 minutes. A good time management is extremely important. After all, I gotta set up the Izakaya immediately when it's time. However, if there's nothing to do, you also no problem to simply idle and pass forward time until nightfall. All work and no play makes Misty a dull bird. Hold down the sprint key when moving to increase movement speed. As my level goes up, I'll be able to run faster. Okay. Eh? Are you asking me why I can't just fly to the destination? I can fly in the future, but it may be different from the literal kind of flying that you're expecting. Yeah, look forward to it. And so my little story, my big adventure, starts right now in your hands. Alright. Tasks. By request of Chen, so you borrowed debt to pay for your friend's debt. I admire your loyalty, though I do wonder if you can manage to pay back this amount before the deadline. Good luck, Burba Brain. Okay. Nothing here. Nothing here. That's me. Yokai Trail. Named so because Yokai are often cited here. This is the only path to human Yokai Shrine. It lacks security, so humans rarely take this way, yet it's a harbor for Yokai. Okay. Cook time. Fresh tofu. Okay. Okay. I really appreciate all the buttons are like, they actually show what button it is. Named, okay. So, it's a neat looking map. You can find these resources here specifically, okay. It's like a fast travel map, I suppose. Mistia can run. Chat. So what should I say to the chief priestess next, hmm? Looks like she's deep in thoughts, better leave her undisturbed. Let's go somewhere else. Put it simply, make money! Your izakaya serves dinner and midnight snacks only, right? Utilize your time in the morning to collect ingredients and drinks. Cook delicious food with those ingredients and serve them to your guests in the evening when you open. If you keep this up, you'll definitely accumulate a little wealth over time. If you have money, you can fulfill your dream. Misty, are you too tired? Here, I'll remind you once more. Let's get on with it. I don't know why, but I feel kind of dizzy. I completely forgot my routine. Anyway, my is Oh, oh, oh. No! Sometimes the, the, the skip button just stops skipping. Ah, memory lapse. Ah. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep. Thank you. How to save. Hmm, Misty, you have a diary, right? After the summary screen every night, you can record your progress of the day in your diary as long as you remember to save. Even if you close the game, you can continue where you left off next time. Super convenient. While many players want to save whenever and wherever they want, unfortunately, because this game is designed to assuming that all the story events are progressing only at the end of the day, changing the save feature this late in development is no longer feasible. Not to mention players could actually softlock themselves if they are not careful. Rest assured that we will try to implement this feature in future titles. For this game, unfortunately, you have to save at the end of each day. Wow. I wasn't expecting that level of, like, answer from you, Kyoko, but thank you. <laughs> First, remember to save every day. Second, please do not only have one save and keep overwriting it. Having multiple saves can reduce the risk of data corruption. Not to mention you can go back and relive the story events once more. What's the proverb again? Don't put all the meat in one plate. Third, backup saves when you can. While this game does support Steam Cloud Save, this Valve feature is sometimes buggy and can occasionally corrupt your save files. Kyoko, what the fuck are you talking about? What's a Valve? What's a Steam Cloud? You can browse game file and find your save data. What do you mean save data? <laughs> Just copy the entire folder and move it somewhere else. Fourth, if you encounter bugs or other services, you can send an email. What's an email? <laughs> Also, you can immediately enter the game file, double-click log data attached to your email. We can pin the bug down immediately. And that's it. Enjoy the game. Bye. 
Seems like animal spirits are favored by humans. Bah! We yokai are clearly more advanced than animal spirits. Alright, let's take a look around town. I don't know if time moves on its own or if it's dictated by actions I take. Kiddo, don't forget the yokai trail offers ample resources that are all nature's treasures. Okay, so yeah, so grabbing ingredients moves the time ahead. So, take a look around. Can't go that way. Doesn't hurt to take a look around the area. I probably have enough time to gra like grab everything anyway, but I do want to get a lay of the land first and foremost. Yeah! Not quite a fishing mini game. I don't know what I'm gonna use a cicada shell for. You feed me a okay who loves cooking. What should I eat today? If you don't mind, how about coming to my izakaya tonight? Always check if your cookware is right for the dishes you decide to serve. You have enough ingredients. It's always a good idea to be careful. That's true. Okay. Lamprey is definitely my, my star dish, so I want to have a surplus of that. Those human toys look interesting. I heard the human kid's teacher is also a yokai. If that's true, then we should be able to attend, right? Ha, <laughs> I don't think it's possible for a yokai to be a human teacher. Oh, potatoes. Nice. It is currently 14 o'clock. Okay. Skata shells are used as fish bait. Oh. Boar meat and venison. Oh, so that's what the traps are. Okay. I'll take a look at my stuff in a moment. Okay. Trout. 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 Let me see. Uh, seafood. It's categorized nicely. Yep, Pisces, lamprey. Common pork for domestic pigs, valuable venison that's hunted in deep mountains, boar for the hunted in deep mountains, tastes very wild, I don't have any beef. Common tofu sold in the human village stores, common potatoes are very, very common. Common radish in the human village, seaweed, onion, pumpkin. Wild honey that beehive, from beehives that can be found on trees, slow cicada that can be found on the tree trunks. Strange. Dew. Dew that can only be collected in the early morning, a bit rare. Oh. A bit rare, huh? I guess so. I can only grab that in certain spots at certain times. Well, I can grab four more ingredients. There's like an area behind my house, but... Oh, here we go. Right here. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Iberico pork. Oh, it's shiny, so it's probably rare. Uh, Iberico that breeds in high mountain, very high grade. Legendary meat. Oh, shit. Okay. Nice. Um, there should be two more things to pick up. All oh, the fishing spots came back. Okay. Honey. Okay, spots, spots return. Wait, whose house is that? Oh, that's that's the uh, that's that's Raymu, right? That, that's gotta be. Is that Raymu house? This location is between the human village and the shrine, right? So surely that's Raymu house. It's about time I should get ready to open the izakaya now. Here is the interface for tonight's izakaya. Here I can choose where to open my izakaya. Unfortunately, currently I only know the way around the yokai trail, so for now this is the only available place. But I'm sure that one day I'll branch it all over against Tokyo. This is a short summary of what I know about this region. Right now I only have a small cart and it only has three countertops and can accommodate three dining sets. It really isn't much, but I believe things will get better in the future. These are records that I've made regarding the kind of uh, guests will come here. Cat, fox, rabbit, tanuki, and snake. Knowing what kind of guests will come and dine could help me decide what meals to serve at that location. This is where I select my helpers for the night. For now, Kyoko will help me serve drinks. Once a guest places an order, Kyoko will bring the drink from the wine cabinet to the guest. This is how we run the place as a duo. After double checking everything, I just need to keep holding this button and head to the location to set up the izakaya. Okay. 
A red lantern illuminating the night over some cheap but durable dining tables and chairs really manages to create a peaceful and carefree atmosphere for dining guests. Guests here are guests are here for the emotion, freedom, and of course, food. Can have three dining sets and guests simultaneously host three groups of guests. Okay. So I hold LB. Okay. Can I look at... I can't look at anything specific, it seems. Alright. Okay, alright. And you gotta hold the button. Woo! So what am I looking at now? Provide at least one cuisine, provide at least one drink, prepare at least one kitchenware. Am, is, oh, is this what I'm putting on the menu? Oh. Well... I don't really have anything else, right? Isn't that all I could put on? I don't have recipes. Oh, there we go. Well, I need a... Uh, oh, I see, I see. Oh, I see. So I need... I need a... Uh, now I understand. I changed the tab. I can only bring three pieces of, uh, of equipment. And I it tells me which equipment I need for each dish. So I need to bring the grill, the pot, and the cutting board. And then I supply the drinks as well. I understand. Okay. I see, I see. I gotcha. Ho! Oh. Now begins my night shift. Although it's just a small cart right now, one day it will become a big izakaya. Well, here are your countertops. I can follow around all the recipes used at the kitchenware. Why is Kyoko idling? You know, it's a $4 charge for lollygagging. Please note the difference recipes may require different kitchenware. This is with a wine cabinet. I can retrieve drinks here. If I got the wrong one, I can put it back at any time. Here's the food storage container. I can place dishes that are already completed in here and serve them later, but we don't serve leftovers. If anything isn't served the night it's cooked, it gets discarded as trash, so make sure not to cook too much. Oh, I see. So you can... You can prep it ahead of time. Okay. These are dining tables and chairs so that guests can sit down and eat. Why am I even explaining this? <laughs> guests will arrive soon and they will sit at a vacant table. They're also very polite and will line up if there are no vacant seats. However, once they sit down at a table and place their orders, guest patience will start to go down. If the guest order wasn't served before their patience wore out, they'll leave angrily, I think. Better make sure this doesn't happen. This is the atmosphere of the Izakaya tonight. If I keep providing satisfactory service, the atmosphere will improve, which will bring in more guests, and guests will also place more orders. This is the key to making more money. Here's my partner's status. After a guest orders something, my partner will act accordingly. Currently, Kyoko will help pass out the drinks. You can see her work status. She'll be resting when she doesn't need to do anything. More jobs and partners should become available in the future. Finally, if you're tired, you can hold the button in the circle to close the izakaya earlier, and that's all I have to say. It's a bit long, but I hope you can have fun. Okay. Okay. Well, Misty is taking the order, right? Right? Kick out. No, don't kick out. She gets the- okay, she gets the drink. So I just have to bring the food. Okay. So it's not a bad idea to have one of everything prepared, I suppose, just in case. Alright. No, 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 no. There we go. Why is Izakai a shadow after operating a long time? Shut up! I'll kick you out! Wait, she still wants to eat? Oh, shit. Alright. Here. Okay. No, 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 no. Don't cook cicada shells. 
Kyoko, go take her order, please. I keep okay. There we go. Kyoko, go take her order. Tofu. Okay. Hmm. Aha. Ho ho. Whoosh. 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 Seaweed? I got that. <laughs> Instant. Sincere service for a smile. <laughs> okay. Currently 80 yen. Kick out. Why would I ever kick someone out? I'm, I'm sure I'll get a tutorial for that. Don't want the tofu. You're tanuki. You don't want tofu. You want lamprey. Yeah. A yokai ought to eat meat after all. True. Okay. This is it, Luigi. If I leave it too long on the grill, hmm. I wonder. I don't think you're gonna want, yeah. Yeah. Time's running out. I'll pick one more on the, the throw a shrimp on the Barbie, why not? Come on, I hope you want exactly what I'm holding. Oh, fuck yeah, look at this. Instant service. <laughs> not bad, not bad. You got that instantly. Come on now. I can't even tell how much time is really passed. You're gonna want another one, right? Oh, no, tofu. Oh, shit. At least time freezes in the cabinet. I gotcha. Okay. Oh, uh, hello, Elf Cyrus. How you doing? Don't want tofu. I'll... Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. What do you mean, wrong dish? Oh! Ah, fuck! Ah! I gave it to the wrong guy! I, I didn't realize, I didn't realize! I thought, I thought... Ah, fuck! I thought she was done eating! Everybody else only wanted one meal! Well, now I have extra... Uh, damn it. Whoops. I gotta pay attention to the numbers. I, I was I just I wasn't paying attention to them. I was just assuming they were done eating and that order that came up was the the first order that came up was the guys. There we go. Okay. That's that's unfortunate, but you know what? Better it happen early and not later. Okay. What do I have in my storage right now? One yakitori. Hmm. I'm not gonna make any more uh, surplus. Just gonna make on a need a need to need ma make basis. I can't tell what time it is though. Honestly, I can't. All right. Woo! Oh. Max vibe, 100%. Beverages, all tea. Mmm. I goofed that, though. Revenue, 225 yen. Damn, man. It really costs 8 yen for, like, miso soup? 8 yen. <laughs> 
served rare guests. Oh, there's a lot of shit in here, isn't there? Diary. Are you sure you want to save? Oh, okay, yes, yes, save, please. Thank you. Okay, okay. <clears throat> eh, there's a uniform here. And a letter? How did you get into my house? Dev team, thank you for playing our game. Toa Misty as Izakaya went on early access June 2021. Full release in October 2021. Today we are proud to announce that we have sold over 100,000 copies worldwide. Jesus Christ. We really appreciate everyone's support and feedback. While we continue to update the game, we wanted to do something more to express our gratitude. <clears throat> Valentine's Day is around the corner, so we made this butler uniform just for you. Hope you like this uniform and our game. I don't understand a thing in this ladder. However, this uniform fits me perfectly. Maybe it's from that mysterious voice again. Might as well just give it a try. Okay. A butler uniform. It was the 17th best-selling Chinese game for 2021. Wow. <laughs> Thank you for playing. This is a little token to express our gratitude. We look forward to making the game even better in the future. That's kind of insane. You know what? I'll try it on. Why not? Yeah. I'll, I'll try it on next shift. Uh, yeah, it's, I told you, this game has uh, good numbers on Steam, but, but I didn't realize it was that, like, it did that well. I can see how. There's a, there's a ton to this game already, right out the, right out the gate. Alright, I guess now we just look around. Wait, why am I wearing this? No, it's my work uniform. No, 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 no. Don't wear it at work. Yeah, put that on. However, I want you to wear this at work. Yes. No. Yes. Surely that works, right? I don't know. It, it seems weird. Whatever, I'll just do that. Yeah, whatever, I'll just do that. <clears throat> well, I, I try to set it, but then I, I can't wear it unless I'm wearing it on casual. Got some dew. Okay. Let's get some of that rare dew. Hmm. Oh, it's only 10 o'clock. Sprint, Misty. Uh, sprint. When you see the red lanterns in the distance, you can't really control yourself walking there. Thank you! To reach the Harkaday Shrine, one must pass the Yokai Trail. The trail does not guarantee safety for humans, so most potential visitors give up. Wow. There are thousands of different dishes in Gensokyo. After tasting these delicacies, who in their right mind would still eat human flesh? Indeed, it's rare to see a man eating Yokai in Gensokyo nowadays. It's true. Oh, what's this? Sparrow sake. Yo, that's the good shit. That's the signature right there. Items. Supposedly made by sparrows, rice is put in hollow bamboo, and when water flows into it, a wonderful sake is made over time. Rumor says drinking this wine makes you dance endlessly. What a cursed delicacy. Yes, the legendary sparrow sake. Makes sense to be in this game. Remember that chapter of Sengetsu say where the three fairies went and got some? They had some of that sparrow sake and they learned, you know, the origin of it. That's a neat origin story. I'm sure it tastes great. It's made with the from the rice that's used as offerings at gravestones. But only sparrows are allowed to take it. The sparrows take the sake, they put it in bamboo, and then they forget about it. <clears throat> if I if I didn't pocket enough cash, then I could only order cheap dishes on the menu. Ma'am, please have some affordable dishes for me. Okay. I like that story because it, it it's like sparrows are great and nice and helpful, and woodpeckers are fuckers. Fuck those birds. Pieces of shit. They're gonna just they're just gonna peck at wood their entire life and just eat grubs in the trees. Fuck you. It's like damn bro. What do you got against woodpeckers? <laughs> I'm looking for a lamprey. Gotta stock up on the signature dish. 
<clears throat> Woody Woodpecker, man! <laughs> oh god, what a what a creature. Why am I only finding seaweed? Hmm. What? Come. There you go. That's some fish. Okay. I know Woody Woodpecker. He got a he got a live action CG movie. You know. Maybe you didn't want to know that. Sorry, I apologize. But now you know. <clears throat> Woo! Potato and radish. I'm looking more on the meaty stuff. I don't actually have any recipes for meat yet, but I want. I have plenty to make miso. I would like. I would like more. Uh, more fish. I can get through four more harvests here. Trout, lamprey, lamprey. So things are dictated by time of day, huh? Okay. <clears throat> That's good to keep note of. Okay. Oh, I got another rare pork. Okay. Um, looks good to me. Yep. <clears throat> I'll open here. Okay, and uh, you know, 73, 21, 12. Oh, okay. Well, not many people want the tofu at least, but I should probably get some ingredients for that next time around. Okay, got that. Uh, the sparasake is expensive. Should I put it on the menu now? If I don't put it on the menu, will people want it? I assume not, right? Because they can't order it if it's not on the menu. But do I really want to put up Sparrow Sake right now? I'm sure there will be better things in the future. Eh, you know what? Fuck it. Why not? I gotta I gotta get things done in a t timely fashion, so... Oh. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> it makes sense, yeah. I'm just worried, like, if I run out and they order it, right? That That's a problem. But I assume I won't use more than five today. <clears throat> well, yeah, you can cook things that are on the menu. But the menu dictates what the people know that you can order, right? Unless somebody, unless we have a secret menu or I have a regular who knows, like, what I can make. I, I, but I don't really know if that's a thing yet. Because the game is introducing concepts at a, at a good pace. Okay. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Oh, look at that. Look at that outfit. God damn. I dig that. Hey, the shit! Take a seat. I need tofu and radish. Okay. Don't leave it too long on the cutting board. It might spoil. Okay. Okay. Miso soup and tea. Okay. I'll leave my surplus on that. I'm not getting much customers anyway. I don't really need to do that, but it keeps me busy. Mr. Tanook, I'm sure you. I know what you want. I can't say I understand how the timer works very much. <laughs> I'm not really looking much at it to register out what it's doing. Oh, wait, I see now, I see. It starts at six, it ends at 12, right? When it makes a full rotation on the white circle, it the, the, the hand ticks, the hour hand, I see. And the highlighted bit is how long it's open for, so it's open for six hours. 
<clears throat> okay, I get it, I get it. I now understand. Table three, table three. Oh, tofu, okay. Okay. Okay, all right. What do we have in here? One lamprey, one seafood. All right. Halfway through the shift. That's all you wanted? That's it? I wonder how you'd feel you walk up to this izakaya and you just see the person behind the counter doing doing donuts around their tables. <laughs> Woo! Tricks. Decide, damn it. I don't know about you, but if I if I ordered food and I watched the person running the stand run over to their their fucking cooler and open it and then pull out their food, I would be a little bit like, uh, <laughs> maybe not, buddy. It takes seven seconds on the grill. I think it's fine. Hmm. Oh, a double. Oh shit. Uh oh. It's coming, it's preparing. Oh. Whew. Okay. Damn, I prepared that. Just in case, but it might have been a, a wasted a uh, waste of ingredients. I thought, the, I thought the double table was gonna be a little bit scarier. They might finish it faster. Oh no, no! Did I job it? Oh, you're a wolf. You're a wolf. You're definitely gonna want. You're definitely gonna want, right? Yes. No. Yeah! Time up! Alright, only one thing went to waste, but it was the it was one I can make 70 of, so I'm okay with that. Oh shit! They want the sparrow sake! Yeah! Enjoy your meal, enjoy your meal, enjoy your meal! Whoa! Oh! Oh! No food wasted! No food wasted! Nice! No waste. 100% vibe. Hee haw! Hee ho! Level up! <laughs> Oh, boog! Rago visits Yokai Trail has been recorded in the book. Hello. Don't ignore me, you saw me here. Ah, it's Rago, what's up? You dare ask what's up? Seeing the Lord of Fireflies and not catering to her immediately? You've grown some guts. I see. I mean, you can just order and I'll bring your order to you. <laughs> what? Are you telling me to fuss over what to eat? And then regret my choice as I wait for the food to arrive, just like any other common guest does. Come on, isn't everyone else doing this? <laughs> Don't compare me to those guys. Ugh, oh, this is confounding. What exactly do you want? Wait, Mistia, come over for a second. What is a Kyoko? I think this is what they call omakase. Omakase. I don't quite get it, but I think this is a professional, as a professional chef, you can't just wait for guests to tell you their needs. Instead, you should actively try to understand what they want and tailor to their needs. But what am I gonna, how am I going to predict what they want? 
This is a challenge for you, the proprietress. If you try hard, you can do it. Ah, she's ordering now. Give it a try. I don't think I can do this. Rare customers do not directly tell you what they want. They will give you hints based on their preferences. Move to the table and open the order panel to learn more. It would be great if all dishes can be sweet. I want low alcohol beverage. Check and determine which tag the guest wants to the cuisine and beverage. Okay. Seems like she wants something sweet, but Kyoko, it appears we don't have anything sweet. It's okay, calm down. A competent chef can creatively modify recipes based on their experience. Here's some honey I collected at the Yokai Trail this afternoon. Try adding it to the original recipe. She wants a sweet dish. Let's open the kitchenware. Whoa. Some cuisine do not work well with certain ingredients. You'll know because certain tags will have an X in the pro property section. Okay. Strange. Retrieve the finished cuisine from the kitchenware. Open the wine rack. Uh, choose a beverage that has a mild tag. What? A simple blend of whiskey, juice, and soda, all commonly available in Isikaya. Now everyone can enjoy the drink thanks to the reduced alcohol content. Choose the beverage that has mild tag. What? You mean mid? Hold on. She said she wanted low alcohol content, right? There's no alcohol in the green tea. There's mild alcohol in the sparrow sake. And the game just gave me the fruity highball. So surely it's the fruity highball. Exit the wine rack. An appetizer for cooling off in summer. So I cooked it with honey, which gave it a sweet tag. I see. Okay. Serve the completed order to the customer. Here you go, you needy little shit. Success! Bravo! Stronger yokai and humans are often harder to satisfy, and situations like this one may happen again in the future. If they are dissatisfied, horrible things might happen. But on the other hand, if we manage to satisfy those rare guests, maybe something good will happen. You're so optimistic, Misty. Yeah, that's the spirit we need. Uh, I did ask for something sweet, but this is too mild. I don't like bland tasting stuff. Whatever, never mind. The food's not bad, but just so-so. Why am I only getting a mediocre review? We tried hard and even added honey. It seems that satisfying a rare guest specific request alone doesn't guarantee the best review. We should also consider their usual. From now on, I'll record every guest's likes and dislikes. Cooking is just like fighting a battle. You'll regret it if you're not careful every step of the way. Sometimes rare, familiar guests will show up. If you manage to understand what they want, you can get some exceptional rewards. But if they are disappointed, also regardless of rare or common guests, you could earn a nice tip if you treat them nicely. It might even become part of your main source of income. Yo, she sprinkled the salt! <laughs> Served normal guests, eight. Served rare guests, one. Okay, not bad, not bad. No expenses. Income was good, I think. Performance? Good vibes? Sure. You sure you want to override? This is the irreversible operation. Yeah, sure. Mm -mm. Okay. I don't have any more fruity highballs. Oh, no. Where'd all my onions go? I need more tofu, dude. I have to buy it, though, I think. I don't think I can just get it. Okay, hold on. I want to put on... No. Okay. Ah, 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 ah! All right, we're fine. By the way, Kyoko, hmm? you were a big help yesterday, thanks to the honey you gave me earlier. It's important to stockpile on ingredients like they said. It's good to always be prepared for the unexpected. 
Speaking of which, Misty, you know how I acquire ingredients, right? Ah, I can usually collect quite a bit from the Yokai Trail, depending on my luck. That's right, you get extra ingredients when you're lucky. Ingredients need time to replenish themselves after being collected, and you can't keep taking from Mother Nature without giving her time to rest. I'm always grateful. And by the way, I think there's a right time for collecting certain ingredients. Pay attention to this. We're going to open our izakaya here for quite a while, so we have plenty of time to figure out where all the good stuff is. Or find all the good stuff. But don't get too obsessed with gathering ingredients either. We still have an izakaya to run at 6. On the other hand, if you don't have anything else to collect, you can open up early. But I still feel worried, although the yokai trail's ample ingredients is not quite enough if we use them all. Use them up at late night's rate. Hmm, of course, we're not going to rely solely on gathering ingredients. Look over there! On the other side of the bridge. Yeah, there's a human merchant over there who sells ingredients. However, he's jacking up his prices knowing that I'm not human. Bastard! <laughs> but that takes money. Gotta spend money to make money. That's how you run a business. Misty, you really give off an impression of a proprietress when you're saying things like these. I am a proper proprietress to begin with. Even when my business is pretty small. It doesn't matter. Let's work hard. On uh, one day, we'll have a giant izakaya. No, multiple izakaya. Okay, hold on. I want to look at my... My recipe tab. Fresh tofu. Paying off debt. News. Album. Wriggle. An old friend of mine who loves insects. I really can't, can't handle the swarm around here, even though I have known her for many years. I have a bond level. She likes sweet stuff and low alcohol stuff. But she's not vegetarian, and she doesn't like mild. Okay. So maybe they should fix that thing telling me to pick mild, huh? So rare customers. Frequently seen at Yokai Trail. Okay. Fresh tofu, beverages, ingredients, kitchenwares, items. Yokai Rabbit. Even as a yokai, they still like fresh... And sweet food, how cute. Of course, it's impossible for Yokai to have a meal without meat. Oh well, at least they're still cute even when eating meat. Thank you, Laplace, for the resub. Yokai cat. <laughs> a Yokai cat, hard to misidentify these because they have two tails. Surprise. Supposedly stronger Nekomata's tails are further apart. They look cute, but they're actually mean, fierce, and aggressive against Tokyo. Even a wild cat is a picky eater. Supposedly an ancient monster. Well, the keyword is ancient. They're no longer the fearsome beast now. Most Tao Ti beasts only possess a big appetite. Not only do they eat a lot, they also demand quality food. <clears throat> they often talk as if they know everything. Feels like they're bragging about their old age and ego. That said, sometimes their advice is actually pretty useful. Maybe they really did learn a thing or two given their long lifespan. A short-tempered yokai always acts that they are better than everyone else. In reality, they are not strong enough to back up their stance. However, Tanuki are very good at tricks and disguises. Beware, they may pay your bills, their bills with leaves. Oh, you better watch your ass, buddy. Wriggle. No information, no information. Kyoko! She's an honest and optimistic Yamabiko, a yokai who repeats what one said back to them, who's been living in the mountain valley since ancient times. I heard she entered the temple because she was disappointed that humans are becoming increasingly more scientific. We became best friends a few years ago due to our shared interest in music. Oh, she's fucking adorable. <laughs> Movement speed, work speed, special guests. Oh, okay. Okay. How to satisfy rare customers. Both this. Sure, I'll remind you once more. Wait, no. No, don't do it. No. No, don't do it. No! No! <laughs> I understand. Let me escape. 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 Alt. Delete. Escape. Escape. Alt. Delete. Ah. Uh... Uh... Take your goddamn fruity highball and touch grass. Alright, thanks for the info. 
Okay, let's take a look around. So, time of day is important for finding things. So, I can see the dew. The dew is rare, but I don't actually have anything to do with the dew yet. And it seems lamprey only comes out in the afternoon, which I assume the afternoon means... 12? Or past 12. So then, what about meat? What about early morning meat? A dish strictly following the recipe is soulless. Feel, free, feel the heart of your customers. I have faith in you, kiddo. Alright. Sure, dude. Can pull seaweed out of the in the morning. Take a look around. Hmm. Always check if your cookware is right for the dish you decide to serve. If you have enough ingredients, always gonna need to be careful. Hello, bastard. I have new products today. Come and check them out. Don't worry about the price. Egg. Common egg you can get in stores. Pork, beef, tofu, potato. Chili. I agree. Added spices to food, but are op but options are of uh, a bit are opinions that are polarized. Pumpkin, fruity highball, mio, fizzy sake with extra bubbles. It's sweet and sour. Has a low alcohol content, making it very popular among girls. Fruity sour, a simple blend of shochu juice and soda, all commonly available in izakayas. Compared to the highball, it's one of the more of Japanese drink. Bamboo shoot, common bamboo shoots you can find in the okay. Buy all of the ingredients. I have 551 wing wangs. Might as well buy the ingredients, right? I'd like some tofu. Um, a raw egg? Why not? I'll get five of those. Three of those. Three of those. This costs 24. Hundred and nineteen. Sure, why not? Thirteen, and I'll bet I'll have uh, fourteen to match. There we go. Damn, those radishes are costly, huh? Okay, confirmed by. There we go. I have stuff now. <clears throat> Bamboo shoots will be worth something in the future. Those human toys look interesting. I heard the human kids teaches also a yokai. Yeah. Okay, there's no traps, it seems. So I guess I should grab the dew, or I should try to see what the plants give me in the morning. Maybe it's different. I don't really need the dew at the moment. Four potatoes, okay. Honey and cicada. Mm. Keeping my eyes peeled. Yeah, I'm looking for that. Still can't make meat. Boar meat. Chili, radish, potato. Alright, so yeah, the dew lasts for two hours. Between 10 to 12. So now that's 12 o'clock. Um, I don't seem to get much of anything except honey and cicada shells. I have no idea what to do with cicada shells. More Sparrow Sake is good. I gotta remember that spot. I gotta remember to check that spot. Five Sparrow Sake is very good because it's 50. It costs 50. That's a big, uh, big haul. <clears throat> if I run out, I had a feeling they can order, so I gotta be careful what I put on the menu. Trout. Lamprey. Trout. Radish. To be honest, I don't know. Uh, but what's the deadline? 11 days. Uh oh. 11 days, huh? More lamprey. Very good. I could do three more hauls. like to get some meat if possible meat or fish well actually radish isn't bad either for tofu 
potato, a radish. I got a chili pepper as well. It only costs one, but I can add it to things if somebody wants something spicy at any point. So, it wasn't too bad. Two lamprey. Nice. Rare customers, Wriggle. Okay. So, Wriggle likes sweet things and mild alcohol content. Okay. I'll remember that. So, what do I currently have, anyway? The same stuff, yeah. So, it's... It's... It's veget... So, the tofu is vegetarian, but she doesn't want vegetarian. But, can you put... Can you put honey on grilled lamprey? Will that... Will that be good? She wa- cause she likes- she likes, uh, low alcohol content, and she doesn't like vegetarian stuff. So, giving her the tofu worked in the tutorial, but because it's labeled as vegetarian, it, it kind of ticked her off. Also, it's labeled as mild, so... She didn't really want that. So, I assume if I- if I slather the lamprey in, uh... If I slather the lamprey in honey, she'll like that better than the tofu. I've never really had honey with, like, anything. Honestly, I haven't. I've never really had honey. Okay, and I can put four drinks on the menu. So, we'll go with the classic. I will put the fruity highball on there because that's the one that she likes. Actually, the fruity sour is sweet. Oh, they're all sweet. They're all sweet. Honestly, let's go with the fruity highball. Sparrow sake. And... I guess I could put the Mio on the back. Why not? And then pot, grill, cutting board. Okay. There we go. Hmm. I know. Looking at uh, at uh, at Riggles, just like likes two of the t two of the things on the tofu she didn't really like, but she liked the the honey. But that was, again, that was a tutorial. I had no choice but to go through with it, right? Nice. Just what I needed. I got plenty of seaweed, so not hurting on that. Doesn't hurt to have one of everything just prepared in the back, I suppose, just in case of a rush, but it's still really early. So I assume Riggle can just show up at like any point, huh? But she she gives you the most they, they can give you the most money, but if you fuck it up, they can they can do some bad shit. Or I could just kick her out, but I don't want to deal with her. Good with alcohol. Okay. There's a lot of tags to keep in mind, for sure. Okay. I gotta be careful with my tofu stuff. I don't wanna- I really don't wanna have a surplus of that, cause I don't have much in the way of ingredients. And it, I can't farm tofu, I have to buy it. Everything else I can find. I'm definitely gonna need more lamprey. I will need more lamprey, so dedicate a whole day to that. Mm. Oh yeah, the journal is always right here. I actually completely forgot about that. Yeah, she likes sweet things and low alcohol. So as long as I can give her something that has sweet, low alcohol, and no mild or no vegetarian, I'll hit like perfect for perfect marks for. Her. I'll remember that. And time freezes while I look over it, as well. Oh, she wants one of the expensive drinks. Okay. How's stock on that? Yeah, stock's fine. 
take a look. Uh, low alcohol and sweet. Dry and bitter. So, it doesn't really matter which one I give her. But I can give her the most expensive one as long as it fits her criteria. It just needs to not be mild and not be vegetarian. The key? That's, uh, ingredients list. And recipe list. All my stuff. Chen visits Yokai Trail. What? What? Yo! Yo, Chen! Oh, shit. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Number three, place your order. Of course cats eat fish. I want a dry beverage. Okay. A dry beverage. I got it, Misty. Don't worry. I mean, Kyoko. Okay. You have my compliment for the sake of this fine dish. Chen likes barbecue kind of foods as we recorded. Okay. There goes two of my Mios already. I was planning to... Oh shit! Oh, she's not done! I want a fruity beverage. Okay. Fruity, fruity. Take a fruity sour. Okay, alright. Chen likes the drink. Oh, there goes the, my last of my Mio. Oh, fuck. I'm coming. Okay. I can't... I can't get him the Mio. There is no Mio. Fuck. Uh... Uh, what do I do? I guess I just give him, just give him, sorry, bro. I want meat. I want a sweet beverage. Meat. Oh, fuck. I can't cook what I don't have a recipe for, huh? I don't have meat. I, I don't have meat. Shit. Well, that is, uh... Oh, you can just shoot them. Oh, okay. Yeah, this isn't meat. The tofu is not meat either. And neither is seaweed. I'm gonna complain to KK about this damn place. Sorry, I just don't have anything for you. I don't have meat. No matter what I give you, you're gonna get pissed off. So it's better I just kick you out and save myself the trouble. Hmm. You can add ingredient. Well, if I add if I add meat to lamprey, th that doesn't even work, does it? Can you add meat to tofu? No. <laughs> I don't think you can anyway. I guess as long as the X isn't there, it'll work, right? Add to the miso soup? No. <laughs> what? <laughs> you could add meat to the miso? That's weird. What the fuck? Okay. Alright, I'll keep that in mind then. Alright. Okay. So I just can't add something to it if it has an X in its tag specifically. But everything else is fair game, I suppose. Mm. Mm -mm. Yesterday was tough. It would be nice if I could prepare some dishes in advance. But if I can't sell them all, they'll be thrown away at midnight. I only have 
I only prepare enough for one day, it should be okay. So I can prepare something in advance? That really doesn't matter. Yeah, like, you can't add meat to that, you can't add greasy to that. But it seems like you can add... Okay, okay, I, I think I get it, I think I get it. I get it, I get it. Okay. Alright, alright. That's fine, that's fine. Take a look around now. I need more... I need more beverages, I think. I wonder what you do with the dew. Oh, I should probably, uh... Let me see. Chen. Rather than calling her the Black Cat of Misfortune, I would say it's more appropriate to call her the Black Cat of Madness. She likes aquatic and barbecued and dry and fruity. Okay. So she's pretty easy to please. And I didn't serve that other rare customer, so they're not appearing in my logbook, huh? Meng Chengguo. Okay. Special guest. The mascot of MC Gensokyo. She traveled here via the Gate of Co Collaboration. As the ambassador here, she is constantly telling the residents the world to visit MC Gensokyo. Her mission statement says she's fostering a friendly environment and promoting each other's worlds. Wow, she had a lot of money! Whoops! <laughs> Whoops! That's like, uh... You know... This uh, budget is about half of what I need. I just realized I can make this. Meat filling barbecued. I could actually make that if I had the ingredients for it. I need more lamprey. I would like to dedicate this day to lamprey more than anything. But I'll remember to get the sparrow sake. Okay. But I want to... Uh, I want to take a gram first. New products today, huh? Salmon, a kind of migratory fish that can be found in rivers and lakes against Tokyo, a bit rare. Premium, huh? Okay. With onion and pumpkin, you can make uh, the energy skewer, but I need multiple. So it's probably better if I get to an area where I can get those normally. Three, three, five. Okay. Okay. Bastard. Go ahead. Take my money. Fuck you. Okay. Seaweed. I don't need seaweed. I guess I'll just get some of this dew. Why not? And the sparrow socket should be in place by this time. No, not yet. Now? No. I will go back for it. I guess it happens around midday, but it's good to keep it in mind. Hmm. The game is currently on sale right now to celebrate, you know, the, the, the latest patch. I bought it when it was on sale last time. It's a good price for what seems to be like a massive game. And it's definitely, it's definitely the kind of game that gets you excited for the next game they work on. It really just kind of came out of nowhere, huh? Just seaweed. More seaweed. Uh-oh, not good. Not good, not good. Hmm. Sparrow sake, are you there? There you are. Nice. It's a good resource to keep in mind. But yeah, I want uh, I want Lamprey. It's a collab character with the three fairies if you have their game on Steam. I do. I have both of them. Where's my collab character? Nice. I couldn't really get into that game though, so uh, the English was too choppy. Nice, nice. Pull the Lamprey up. They really like me, but the mochi in the human village tastes good as well. Humans know what's good. 
don't think I need vegetables right now. I really want to pack up on uh, on meat though. It's just uh, I have to buy tofu and drinks. I don't have I don't have things to mix from my own drinks. It seems. Hmm. Need them installed. I might have to reinstall then. I can do that next time. So time to open the izakaya. Let's see. Wriggle and Chen. Okay. Still can't do anything but level one, but that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. So, I got a lot of lamprey there. Okay. So, T. Nobody wanted Sparrow Sake, but that's okay. I'm gonna put in, put in the Fruity Highball, uh, the Mio, and the Sparrow Sake. And then the classics. Okay, I gotta remember I can add raw ingredients to my existing dishes to fit the need the the needs of the others as long as it doesn't conflict. I gotta remember that. That's important. Very important. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, prep work for today is done. Thanks for your hard work. There's still a little while before we open. Please take a break. I'm fine. You're the hardworking one here, and you didn't need to be so busy in the first place. Mistia can chop. Tofu up in seven seconds without even needing to be at the cutting board. She is pretty fucking good at her job Why are you still saying that you don't owe me, you know, I'm doing this out of my own will Plus my business got so much better with your help. I should be thanking you Thanks, I feel so happy having a friend like you even though it's a bit stressful I'm very happy to run an izakaya like this together with you Me too. Actually if all this didn't happen. I was going to form a band with you a band That'd be a lot of fun. Uh, I miss my singing days. Hmm. If your passion for music cannot be satisfied, why not try to imbue your feelings with cooking? Huh? The head priest has said that no matter what you're doing, devoting your emotions will always result in better outcomes. What would result from a clash between music and food? Isn't it interesting if you think of it like this? If you sing to plants, they grow. Fact. If you sing to meat, it tastes better. Also, fact. <laughs> singing while cooking and cooking through singing both sound nice. As long as I let my body follow the rhythm's guide. What? Misty loves singing, especially when cooking. She gains special power when the performance is great, but if the performance is terrible, her cooking skill will also drop. What? At what part am I hitting this? Each full combo of Sparrow Tomb will randomly activate one of the following three abilities. Tortetsu Feast. This allows customers to finish eating immediately. Patient Freeze. That allows customers to have unlimited patience while the effect. Misty of Prime Delivery. That allows Misty to toss dishes from across the room right onto the guest table without spilling a drop. <laughs> when Misty activates all three abilities, it will be upgraded to Hyper Mode, which contains all three effects. While this is active, you no longer have to perform Sparrow Tomb. <laughs> You can check out the activated buffs here. Follow the rhythm of the music and let Sparrow Tune echo in the sky. Okay, I think it's when the line hits the, the stem of the note, not the start of the note. But I can't really tell until I do it. Alright. Prime delivery. Slip and slide. What? Huh? No! Oh! Oh. Okay. Double notes are weird, huh? There you go. What? Do I have to hold that one? Is that a hold note and it didn't tell me? Oh, okay. Alright. Oh, shit! Oh, the dish is ruined! Oh, no! Dark matter! The embodiment of failure is an indescribable cluster of mess with a dark aura. No one in the right mind would eat this, right? You never know.
Nice. That's a good lamprey. Dark matter. I'm gonna feed that. I'm gonna feed that to Rumia. I hope she shows up. <laughs> okay, so now there's now there's a mini game to the cooking aspect. Somebody's gonna order dark matter one day. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I, I noticed. I noticed the background music. The music is tied to the background music. When I was doing all those tap notes. I'm not gonna double up on tofu. I'm gonna wait. Once I unlock some music, I can change the background as a music as well. Uh, what was it that she wanted again? Shit, uh... Chen, dry and fruity drinks. Okay. Uh, I have fruity and I have dry, but I don't have dry and fruity, huh? Hmm. Can you add things to drinks? Probably not, huh? Drinks are probably, they come as they, they are. No changing that. Bitter and fruity, sweet and fruity. I guess I can just give her one of these since it's still, uh, it's still dry and it costs a lot. So I'll give her this. I figured if you hit both of them, it's good, but you can hit one or the other, right? And she likes barbecue and fish. Okay. I want a dry beverage. Could you bring out the taste without oil? Oh, how could you bring out the taste without oil? All right. Well, I, I know what I know what Chen likes at least. I'm not gonna press the button when there's no notes because I'm scared I'm gonna create dark matter. Fruity beverage, okay. Fruity beverage. Take a fruity sour. Okay. Oh. Tofu. Okay. Me and Chen were friends like that. You're still hungry? I also like sweets. I want a dry beverage. Oh, fuck. Uh, sweets. Greasy and sweet. Oh, fuck. Uh... Can I add? I guess I can add... I can add honey to the grilled lamprey. Can I add something to make it sweet? Uh, I don't have anything that can make it greasy. I guess this is a fine... Yeah, this is fine. And a dry beverage, okay. Yummy, yummy! Egg! Whoa! Thanks, Chen! Oh, you want seaweed? Oh, shit! Ah, 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 ah. Yeet! How do I yeet? How yeet? How yeet? 
Never say no to abnormal food. I want an iceable beverage. Uh, iceable beverage. Uh, what is iceable? Oh, they're all iceable. Okay. Never say no to anything strange. Is that what she said? Abnormal food. <laughs> no, she doesn't like vegetarian. Vegetarian or mild, like strange and sweet. Okay, let's give her a lamprey with uh, honey and cicada shell. Oh no. Oh, Ruma's here. How satisfying this dish is. You want seaweeds. Chill out. There's no seeds for Ruma. Yeet. They're forming- Oh, God, they're forming a line, dude. Throw the button. Actually, insects can be carnivores, too. I want an iceable beverage. Iceable beverage carnivore. You want meat, right? That's not meat. Okay. You want this with meat. Here. Take this, and this, and this. And create the ultimate food. Iceable beverage. Iceable beverage. Take this Dios Mio. Actually, no, you know what? No, 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 put that back, put that back. An iceable beverage? Take this. You're about to spend some money, Riggle. Money! Eat this seafoam miso soup with a <laughs> strange sweet meat in it. Yeah! <laughs> She loves it! Wait, there's too many guests. Wait, slow down. <laughs> I can't go without a full stomach. I want a bitter beverage. Bitter beverage. Bitter, 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 uh, bitter, bitter. Uh... Bitter. I'm sorry, what was that? A full stomach. She wants something filling, yeah? What what is what what constitutes as filling? Is that is that even a thing? Is that a thing? Can you do that? Filling is a tag. Small portion. Why did my why did my group just scatter? Inexpensive? No, give it. I'll just give her a lamprey with. Uh... What did I get a puffer fish? Legendary luxurious fish, but which is poisonous? Careful processing is needed. Shrimp. <laughs> These shrimp fresh. Freshwater shrimps are distributed in misty lake and Gimbal ravine. Rather common. Tuna, kind of academically epipelagic ep fish that can somewhat be found in rivers and get soaky. A bit rare. Uh, I know. Okay, hold on. I know that she's gonna want meat. It's fucking Ruma. Let's let's be real here. So I'm gonna give her some. Hold on. Can I put multiple of the same ingredient in? And I'm gonna give her a pepper because that sounds funny. I want. It'd be great if all dishes can be sweet. I want a low alcohol beverage. Okay, I got you. One second. I hope you enjoy Ruma. Very tasty. Nice. Low alcohol beverage. Uh, fruity sour. And she wants a sweet dish. Sweet dish, sweet dish. Not vegetarian, not mild. Okay.
Okay. Holy shit, business boomed, man. Is the freshest way to eat something just to eat it raw? I want a bitter beverage. Bitter. That's dry. This is bitter. Okay. Um, dark matter. Bitter, 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 bitter. Bitter, bitter. Bitter. Can I add bitter? I can add mild and spicy. I don't think I can add bitter. Savory. I don't have bitter. She definitely just wants raw meat, yeah. So, I'm just gonna give her... Give her some meat, I suppose. I don't have bitter, though, so let's just do this. Here you go, Ruma. Holy shit, Regal, how much can you put down? I want low alcohol beverage and strange food. Strange food, strange food. Double checking. Not vegetarian, not mild. Oh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, but Riggle won't go home. She's eating like five meals alone. <laughs> Is the fresh way to eat something, just eat it raw. I want a soda beverage. I don't have a soda beverage. Romeo likes soda beverages. Wait, I do actually, don't I? Yeah, the Mio is soda beverage, and she wants meat. So let's give her... Give her the choice cuts, I suppose. Okay. Yeet! <laughs> hi -ya! Rego, go home! <laughs> go home! Strange again, huh? Okay. The combo meter's just gone. The store is closed, Regal. Go home. Oh my god. <laughs> Eat something raw and a bitter beverage. That's dry, not bitter. Probably not any point to adding multiple the same ingredient that has the same effect. I can't seem to hit Ruma's uh, good spots. Pretty good? Okay, well that's fine. Riggle's finally gone, Jesus! Okay. New available recipe, rice ball, level three, level two, base tip percent up. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, that just turned into that just turned into feeding the bug. The bug girl. Kaching. Mm, why do I have why do I have good purchase expense? Wow. That's a lot of stuff. 303. Wow, I made a lot of money today. Damn. Well, I'll have to look at the stats. Another brand new day. Hey. This is... This is the Tengu's newspaper. This will come in handy. I'll use them as a cushion for the wobbly grills. Wait. These aren't human words. How rare it's written in yokai glyphs, so even I can read them. Uh, let me see. Oh, something's going on. It seems that I should prepare for popular trends in the future. Hmm. These newspapers seem pretty useful. For now, I'll cut out the noteworthy parts. I'll read it every day. It's important to stay up to date on what's going on. Izakaya owner saves girl in debt. Maybe the residents of Yokai Trail have caught wind of it, but the owners of the unlicensed Izakaya has come to her friend's rescue after she fell into debt. However, the Izakaya owner herself has ended up in debt as a result. It seems like Japanese food is popular. The Japanese beauty on the cover of this issue of Harper's Bazaar is so charismatic. 
All right, she likes filling, meat, and raw. How do I create a raw dish that doesn't just give her, like, you know... An old friend of mine, she was born in darkness. Molded by it! Ooh, the mask! I'm pretty sure her head is completely empty, but that doesn't mean much coming from me. Okay. Aquatic barbecue, greasy and sweet. Dude, look at that bond level. We're, we're tight. We're friends. Sweet, strange meat. I see, I see. Okay. Now I have rice ball. Inexpensive vegetarian home cooking, popular Japanese trend. Only needs seaweed. And I can add stuff to that as well, like meat and fish and whatnot. Okay. That's a good uh, recipe to have. Nine days left on that. I want to look at the spell cards that I've been, I've been being hit with. Wriggle. Okay, so there's a spell card that she gives you that they hit you if you get a good one, and there's a spell card they hit you with if you get a bad one. Summon a large group of fireflies, enhancing your Izakaya's atmosphere. Guests are 30% more likely to appear. I got five of those. Ruma has not given me anything yet, but Chen gave me something. Randomly obtain three fish ingredients already recorded in the cook decks. Occasionally gives rare ingredients, wondering why fish come out of nowhere, and why fish-loving Chen is willing to give fish to you. You'll be tangled up in thoughts. So, from what, I, from what I'm gathering here, um... What do you call it? So, the more... The more tags I hit, the better the recep uh, reception. So when I when I get something for Chen, if I hit like basically five of the six tags, she'll hit me with the egg thing. So if I hit aquatic barbecue, which is already covered by the lamprey anyway, and I hit her, I get the and I get her with the sweet. That's three. That's three of the five of the six. But the drink, the drink was also one of the other. So I hit her with four. So I think. I guess if the majority of the majority of the food tags are hits, they'll give you the uh, the spell card, I assume. But I don't think Chen stayed for longer than like two meals. And also, as you the more you feed them, the more tags you kind of become aware of. So in Riggle's case, I know what she dislikes. But yeah, the more the more tags I hit, the better the reception. But it's better, you know, it's better to it's better to hit a few than none at all, and it's better to not hit the incorrect ones. I think I get it. I think I understand. Yeah, cause she definitely used she definitely used it, but Riggle kept doing her thing. I formed a formed a whole ass line, but everybody left because the store was closing. But Riggle would not go to fuck home. Jesus. I don't have any music yet to add to the, the thing. <laughs> <laughs> This background is like straight up just uh, Fire Red and Leaf Green's Pokedex. Like this, this is the Pokedex from Fire Red and Leaf Green as the background. <laughs> Chen's got a nail bat. Okay. The Riggle card showed up a little late, but she also just didn't go home, and I didn't have enough tables to serve all the guests that were lined up anyway. That 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 OC came back too, but I couldn't get her. So I'll get some dew. Get some potatoes and chili. What's my money at now? I made a fuck ton yesterday, so. I'll take a look at that. Animal spirits, yep. I need to buy more drinks. A uh, fifteen hundred, okay. I need more drinks. I'm low on uh, I'm low on stuff. Five of each should be okay. Okay. Why not? Seaweed's fine. Radishes are fine. Match the tofu. Salmon, I don't really want. Uh, maybe I'll get some pumpkin for the energy skewer. Potatoes are okay. I need a beef for that as well. So I can make three of those. Pork is fine. I don't really know what I want egg in. Well, wait. If I add a raw egg to something, that adds... If I add a raw egg to something, that... that That'll give it- that'll give points for Rumia. Huh. I- I guess that makes sense, but I was thinking more raw meat, but at the same time, you don't really use raw meat in cooking, so... I can't just give her a raw slab of meat. So I guess the egg- the egg will apply the raw tag to something, and then Rumia will like that. Kinda weird when you think of it like that. Okay. Okay, I like that. Okay. 
Uh, I'm not gonna buy the salmon yet because I have a few other things that are okay with that, but I want the energy skewer essentially to be a possible menu item, but I, th I still have the rice ball first and foremost, which just needs seaweed. So maybe I dedicate the state of fishing again to get some seaweed and lamprey. I mean, seaweed's fine. If anything, I think I'd like meat more than anything. I still don't really know what to do with dew. It adds mild. It adds mild. So there's that. But I'm, I'm not really hurting on it. I got some eggs. Yeah, I have eggs. I've, I've had some for a while, but I just... I didn't really consider... I didn't really consider putting raw egg on something. Because when I was thinking of Rumia, I was thinking of raw meat. Not like a raw egg, you know? Nice. Don't worry, I know the Sparrow Sake. It just doesn't show up till like, late in the day. Get some honey again. Sparrow Sake. Nice. I haven't seen anything on the tree except for, like, honey and cicada. Which is fine, it helps for wriggle, but I don't need that much of it. Um... Hmm. You <laughs> can the strange texture. This game is really cool. I'm really enjoying it. I kind of don't want to stop. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's see. Rare customers, Wriggle, Ruma, Chen. Still can't upgrade my level yet. Um, Let's just do it. Fuck it. Let's play the feud. Alright, so I have four menu items, but now I can make rice balls, which are popular. So this is gonna be the main menu item, I suppose. It needs a cutting board. And then the usual suspects. Yep. Well, I have the stuff for the energy skewer, but I apparently I don't have the recipe for it anymore. That's weird. So this is home cooking, filling, Japanese, and a trend that's popular right now. So people are gonna order a lot of it, and I can add stuff to it. But if I add ingredients to it, it doesn't... If I add ingredients to something, does it up the price? Or does it only add to the tags? And also, if I pick two of the same items that add a tag, does it influence the item at all? Or is it just, uh, is that just redundant? Because I, I did that for the, for Rumi, I gave her the boar meat and the, and the, the pork. But then I stopped putting both of them in there, because they add the same thing. They don't pay more for extra ingredients, it's only for added tags. Okay, good to know, good to know. Alright, so let's see. So, green tea. Um... Fruity Highball, or the Mio, and the Sparrow Sake. I like the Sparrow Sake because it gets you a lot of money if they buy it. And it's uh, it covers the dry bit. Uh, I haven't seen anybody who specifies Western, like what type of fruit uh, drink they want. So I guess I'll just go with this loadout. Okay. Okay, and then the usual lineup should cover that perfectly. The more they enjoy the dish, the more they, uh, enjoy it, the more they tip. Well, the thing is, so if I... Well, adding tags to it is... Adding tags to it is good in that sense, yes. I, I get that much. But it seems like it's more beneficial to do that for rare customers and not really worry about riffraff. Because if I, if I stress over extra ingredients on riffraff, it's, it's, it's gonna be a headache. <laughs> Oops. Okay, I am ready. All right, let's get ready. I'll go get changed. See you later. All right, also... Hey, that's... What? Hmm? Uh, that's... Misty? Good evening? Excuse me? What's going on? Why are there two identical me's? Same with me here. I'm scared. Don't be scared. You are me and I am you. We are from a different... Another world. Could it be another collab world? Yep, we're here to visit you and say hello. Uh, sudden appearances like this are still scary. Sorry, we didn't think about that. Because after we found out you were also running a, a bustling isekai in your world, we didn't even think before we wanted to come over and see it ourselves. Anyway, I'm really thankful for this chance to collaborate with you. You're more than welcome. So what kind of life did I live on that side? Hmm? I run an isekai that only opens late at night, and all those well-known yokai and humans would all visit. They don't order from the menu. It said they want me to just get creative. Oh, that sounds like a pain in the ass. <laughs> it's the same as this world. Sometimes guests will flirt with others. For example, a certain phantom musician had an affair 
with her fan in my izakaya. What the fuck? No, we're totally different in this aspect. What kind of a world is that? Are you interested in my world? No! It would be better to say I feel quite concerned. <laughs> That's why I came here. I'll leave this to you. If you're interested, feel free to take a look at my world, the Sparrow's Midnight Dining. Wait, a book? This is a manga. <laughs> no, it's an ad? Neku Tofu poster. What? It's my story from another world, although it's similar to the story happening here. The story has extra exciting twists too. Content of this poster is, please buy Shinya Suzume Shukuro if you want to know more. You can view this poster in the basement. Hey, who wants to read an advertisement more than once? Excuse me, what? What? <laughs> Did I just get an ad? All right. What do you want, damn it? Rice ball? Alright. One single rice ball in Sparrow Sake. There you go. Not bad, not bad. Damn, you ate fast! Oh, it's because I got the perk right on right now. Alright, well, I guess let's prepare some ahead of time. Neat. Huh, make one of each just back up. But these are just for the... You know, adding extra ingredients helps, so... I'll just keep those as backup for the, the lesser ones, I suppose. Okay. Okay, one of everything and back up, just in case. Woo, woo, woo. Mr. Tanuki. There you go. The owner is not food. No. No, 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 she's not. Misty, a prime delivery. Unlimited delivery reach last. Oh, Ruma's back. Oh, shit. All right, Ruma. I gotcha. I gotcha. I'll kick her out. Joke's on you. I'm into those freaky dishes mentioned by humans. I want a soda beverage. She wants a raw, freaky meat dish. All right. You want a raw, freaky meat Meat dish, huh? Can you add meat to a vegetarian item? It's not very filling. It's popular. Oh, it is filling. Oh, filling's right there. It loses the tag. All right, that's fine. No, that's fine. So if I give her, if I give her this, with an egg, a cicada shell. And pork, that creates the perfect Ruma rice ball. Oh yeah, it even tells you what it's going to come out with. Strange raw meat. <laughs> what was that drink you wanted? I want a soda beverage. Alright. Order up! Whoosh! Moonlight Ray! Whoa, shit! Whoa, where meat? Yo! <laughs> uh, oh. Lamprey and Sparrow Sock. Okay. Yeet! <laughs> Do you have any specialty dishes? I want soda. I do have a specialty dish. That's my my thing here. Okay. You want a specialty dish, but you can't add 
You can't add meat to this, can you? Or will it remove it? Wait, does that work? Hold on. How does that work? If I add if I add meat to the grilled lamprey, does it ha like it has plus meat, but it also has a my like a zero meat thing to it. So it'll it'll make dark matter. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. So instead I just do it without the I do it with the raw and strange bits and she'll take the signature dish. Okay. And what was it? Uh, soda beverage again. Okay. Alright. Whoosh! Okay. More meat! Not bad. Oh, the boog is back. Oh, she's waiting her turn though. Ruma, you're not done. Is there a, is the freshest way to eat something, eat it raw in a bitter beverage. All right, bitter, 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 bitter. Wait, how come I, chat, how come I can put four, I can put five, four things on the menu, but I can still serve things not on the menu. Oh, I see, I see. So, the regular customers will only order from the menu, but for the rare customers, I can give them anything on the menu. I see now. Bitter and raw. Well, let's go with the rice ball again. With, uh, raw, strange, and meat. That should fit Ruma's tastes. Okay. Rice ball. As an insect, I say no. To, no, I uh, want low alcohol beverage. Okay. Low alcohol beverage. Uh, get that one. And shit, what was it again? Uh, sweet, strange, and meat. Okay. Sweet, strange, and meat. It removes the uh, vegetarian tag. Sweet, strange, and meat. Okay. Boar meat. Strange, sweet. Okay. And that should be good for her. Flesh, flesh, flesh! I desire flesh! I want bitter. Jesus Christ, Rumia, chill out. <laughs> I want flesh, huh? And bitter. Flesh, flesh, flesh. Uh... She wants meat, huh? Well, let's just give her the same thing, really. Double up on the meat. Oh, Chen's in line. Insects can be carnivores. I want low alcohol beverage. Okay. Low alcohol beverage. Alright. Flesh bitter. Flesh bitter. Flesh bitter. Flesh bitter. Flesh bitter. I'm giving her a rice ball again. Okay. Raw, strange. Flesh. Okay. Oosh. 
I want roast meat skewered on a stick. I want a dry beverage. Dry. Roast meat skewered on a stick. What? Yeah, make that. Yes, make that, please. Uh, no, make that. I know what that is. I made it before. <laughs> I made it in a dream. Snake eater! Ah, shit. Can I really not make that? I know what it is, though. Meat on a skewer. Well, I can't do that exactly, Chen. Let me see. Aquatic barbecue, greasy and sweet. Well, we'll go with that with the honey, I suppose. I don't have anything that adds greasy. I don't have oil. Okay. Hiya! Okay, uh... Yes. Yummy, yummy. Ruma is done eating. Holy shit. I thought she would never leave. Oh, she gave me stuff, though. Uh... That's on number two, right? Yep, okay. Number one, tofu. Do I have that? I do have that still on spare. Nice. Excellent. Mm -mm. I have it because of the tutorial, but it won't let me make it. It's so weird. Like, I knew I knew I the ingredients, why I bought them, but it just won't let me do it. And, like, that probably would have been what she wanted. Oh, I didn't let go at the end there. Okay. Oh, it uses the grill. Because it's, 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 I did it in the tutorial. It popped up there, it just put a question mark, so I wasn't allowed to make it. Ha ha, yeah. Ho ho ho. Nice, made a lot of rice balls. Nothing expired. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. Look at that money. I need 3,000 big ones. I'm getting there. Yahoo! Good morning, Kyoko. Recently, I was thinking that rather than always having guests come to us, why don't we go visit the guests? Chatting with them, giving them some presents, improve the relationship with guests. They'll definitely visit our izakaya more often. Sounds like a good idea, but where can we find them? Let's just go out and look around. Nice! Ruma spotted! Okay, let me think. Uh, how do I greet her? Rumia, is that you over there? It's me, alright! It really is you! You're always dimming the environment around you. I can't even see your face. Is that so? That is so. However, seeing a black orb flying around in broad daylight pretty much guarantees you're in there somewhere. To a certain degree, it's part of your signature now. Does it look like the Emperor's new clothes? It's actually closer to the Emperor's garbage bag. <laughs> He's a, uh, seems like, I want to trade with human villagers. A yokai child seems to be vexing over something. If you're willing to help him, please go to the entrance to the human village. Ruma likes trendy things. She likes signature dishes. Wow, she has a lot of things she likes, huh? Okay. There's a lot of characters that can show up, it seems. And, uh, Ruma. Randomly obtained three meal ingredient meat ingredients I recorded in the cook decks. Wondering what moonlit generates mystery meat and wondering why meat-loving Rumi are willing to give meat to you? You'll fry your small bird brain. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. What a sparrow- Nope! Nope! You're not getting me again! Ruma, you dimmed your surroundings again. I can't see anything around you. Because it's pretty cool this way, don't you like it? Uh, it does feel very cool under the shade like that. But it's way too dark. I can't believe you can tell where you're going. Of course I can't tell where I'm going. I can't see after all. Eh? Turns out you're just flying around aimlessly. Since I can't see anything in the dark, it doesn't really make a difference no matter where I go. You caused this, you know. 
Is that so? Of course, you think darkness is your ally? Even your dress is entirely black. Isn't normal for- isn't normal for a yokai to like black? Mmm, I don't- I think black is okay. Is that so? <laughs> I mean, no tasty cuisines are entirely black, right? I don't think it's appetizing if I cook some food that is pitch black. That's not the case. Eh? I went to a black food festival somewhere before. Everything they ate at the festival was all entirely black. As someone who can summon darkness, I was treated as a VIP there and even invited to stay for a while. Food that is entirely black. What is that? Does it taste good? Hmm, it smells funny, but it does taste pretty good. Is that some kind of special dark matter that can numb your senses? It's just tofu. Tofu? Are you sure? Hmm, I am sure. How about you find some tofu for me? Maybe I can remember. Then wait here, I'll get some right away. Please, I'll tell you to remember something. Excuse me. What? Uh, recipe stinky tofu. I went to a black food festival before almost all dishes were entirely black. One that smelled horrific but tasted great. Bring me some tofu and I might remember how they made it. Deliver it Okay. Stinky tofu. Ask Ruma to taste test stinky tofu. Spicy dark matter. I was gonna go make dark matter with a pepper in it. This is it. Eh? Hmm, or maybe it isn't? So is it tofu or is it not? Didn't you say you stayed there for a while? Please try again. Hmm, let the tofu just sit there until it fermented? Then fry it? Hmm, is that so? Don't ask me. It is still edible and it's, if the tofu is fermented. Why don't you give it a try? Ah, Misty, are you here to play with me? Ruma, is that you over there? It's me, all right. <laughs> I've, I've, we've talked about this, related tasks. So now I have a recipe. Ask Ruma to taste test. Have Rumia try out your stinky tofu and your izakaya. Alright. Well, I have a new recipe. Stinky tofu. Fermented black tofu with a weird flavor. Those who never tried it often, is this even edible? Do not say it enough. Vegetarian, Chinese, strange, spicy. So it's literally just tofu with a chili pepper in a frying pan. I don't have room for all that though. I'd have to give up something. Well, I guess I can give up this, uh, the pot, because the pot's only used for seafood stuff, right? Okay. Don't ask me how to do it. I won't- I don't- no, Kyoko, no. New products? Uh, well, first I need more egg. Give me all of your egg. Um... Give me all of your egg. Give me more of your drink. All right. Vegetarian and mild. Ah, uh, that adds two tags, but I haven't found anybody who really wants this yet, and it's kind of pricey. So I think I'm okay with not buying that yet. Ahoy! By the way, I wanted to ask you this for a long time now. Nope, don't bother. Why, I haven't even asked anything. I don't play any tricks. I don't have any tricks even if I tried. Why don't you listen to me for once? I wanted to tell you that I'm very grateful that you frequently visited my izakaya, but could you stop showing up with a strict face every time? It's almost like I owe you money. Ah, uh, actually, I do owe you money. Anyway, other guests will mistakenly believe that my food sucks. I mean, that's about right. What? You have problems with my food, then why not just directly tell me? Well, it ain't not that either. I, I, I didn't know to come to your, for your izakaya for dinner. Well, you certainly ate a lot. It was an inspection! An inspection on whether you're working hard or not! Inspection? If you're worried about the loan, I have already told you I will pay it off. You better! It's fine if you insist that you come for inspections, but please don't show a strict face anymore. It's not that bad. I feel pretty bad, let alone other customers. I'm very proud of my food and service. <clears throat> it's just... I'll be really mad if you continue with this nonsense. I, I mean, I'm actually not impressed by your cooking skills. Deep fried... De dried fish crisps are 1,000% better. Mere dried fish crisps. Not just dried fish crisps. It's my secret dried fish crisps. Eh? What's it like? How could I easily show my secret recipe to outsiders? You're making it up. I did not. Listen up. It's... Ah, hold on a second. I'll write it down. You're not mad anymore? I'll forgive you this time. I don't need your forgiveness. However, I'll be more careful in the future. I'm running out of catnip. Kitties might start a rebellion soon. What's wrong? If you nothing need to do, go make me some money. 
Come on, cut me some slack. Furthermore, I only want to have a good relationship with you. W with me? Wh why? Well, our relationship is not exactly great. We at least signed a contract together. Not a bad idea to get on good terms together, is it? Mm, I'm not sure if I can. She didn't say we. She didn't say we can't. What are you talking about? No, nothing. Mm, you really just want to be my friend that bad? Eh? I didn't. Are you mocking me? I really, really want to be your friend. In that case, I'll reluctantly give you the opportunity to know myself. Thank you so much. Alright. Have Chen try out your secret dried fish crypts in the Izakaya. Okay. Um. Requires a cutting board and trout. That's it. That's pretty simple. Aquatic, salty, savory, small portion. Okay, things can be added to it. Ah, big sis, come here, come here. Oh, hello, they here. Or are you p the person who posted that request? Yes, there's a merchant at the entrance of the human village. His toys look really fun, but I'm really scared to talk to a human. Hole up, isn't that backward? <laughs> so big sis, please buy it for me, that thing that circles around when the wind blows on it. Oh, pinwheel. Okay. That's the toy I want. Why'd I just get stuff? Speaking of which, the merchant told me this thing is called a pinwheel. Hey kiddo, yes you, if you want to know pinwheels are made, you can ask me directly. Well, why so loud? Humans are indeed really scary. Are the characters backwards? What just happened? Only idiots would say my product is expensive. Why did you just give me rocks? What? Huh? Bizarre rock. A bizarre rock found in the yokai path. Kind of heavy. The owner Corindo seems interested in it. Okay. I don't know what just happened, but I think I did it. So, alright. Seaweed. I got the eggs. Still need milds. Get the dew. Get more honey and stuff. Yeah, I guess so. You look familiar. Hello there, little sparrow. I remember now, you're from the other world. That's right, you still remember me. I am Meng... Oh god, I died, yep. Gonna butcher the shit out of that. Meng Sheng Guo, the collaboration ambassador for MC Gen Sokyo. You were finally back, where were you before? Your creator and my creator had to temporarily pause the collaboration event for maintenance. However, the maintenance is over. I will be a permanent ambassador here. I will continue to visit your izakaya. Oh, you can continue to purchase special items from my world from me. That's great, so many of my guests complained about it. They thought you'll never be able to experience the exotic dishes from your world again. Look forward to seeing you in the future, not just you, but every resident here. Nice to meet you again. Cubic Kadama Ice Cream, Cubic Kadama Volcanic Tofu, Iceberg Kadama Lemonade. What the fuck is this? Very appealing from color to flavor. Can't be missed when traveling to MC Gensokyo. Huh? They don't have any tags to them. This one does, though. No alcohol. Neat stimulating. Why is neat a tag? I'm not touching this shit, dude. I don't know what that is. Misty, why are you spacing out? Let's play! Oh, Riggle, it's you. What's wrong? It's morning! Yet, you are already so lifeless. Nothing, just pondering new recipes. You're still not playing cook- You're still not done playing that cooking game. Get it over with, let's go on a field trip. I am not in the mood. Jeez, just put random stuff together and call it done! No, you don't get it! Okay, fine, you will play once you get a new recipe, right? I can give you one right here, right now. Eh? Our race has existed in Florida since ancient times. All of our history and culture should date back to... I'll hear your past glory some other time. Please, teach me the new recipe. There, I made it this morning. Uh, boiled egg? Try a bite first. Definitely not just a boiled egg. Mmm. It has a hint of sweetness. How'd you do that? Hehe. <laughs> now you wanna know? Stop tantalizing me! You must have noticed that dew can be collected from trees in the morning, right? Mmm? Uh, yes. Go get some more and I will give you the answer. Aw, oh, why me? Just bring them to me if you want the answer. Dew, runny egg. Is that all you got? Gathering dew drops was never an easy task. Anyways, here they are. Can you tell me now? <clears throat> Still not seeing it? The answer is right in front of you. What do you mean? I was asking why the boiled eggs has a, a sweet, refreshing flavor. Well, because it was boiled in dew. Dew? What difference does the water make while boiling stuff? Unlike us, you birds are so insensitive in this aspect. Do you know? Fireflies are carnivorous in the larva stage. However, we rarely eat or drink anything once we grow into adults. Even on the edge of starvation, we only take in dew and nectar. Why so? As soon as one has learned the taste of dew's sweetness, meat will always be foul and revolting in comparison. What? 
That's why dew is a delicacy of extreme purity that can only be found on morning leaves. Using such ingredients for cooking will alter the taste of everything within it. Therefore, there was no ordinary boiled egg, but a dew runny egg. How fascinating, but it's such a hassle to collect. Let me help. Since it's still early, let's start another round of dew gathering right now. Want to check out some adorable little books? Alright, so I just got to try the new recipes out with these characters when they show up, huh? So what's this recipe? The dew runny egg. Requires a steamer and an egg and dew, and that's it. Well, shit. I can't run all those equipments. I can't give up the grill, and I can't give up the cutting board, so that's gonna have to wait, I suppose. Okay. Alright, alright. Dew is so good that when you eat it, you'll never want to touch meat ever again. Alright. Okay. Alright. That's true, I can pre-cook it. Let me do that. I can use 30 minutes to pre-cook a dish. Right here. Yeah. Okay, yeah. No, I can, uh, I can pre-cook these things for 30 minutes time and give them to their respective owners and then keep my normal lineup. Boiled tofu. Oh, that's new. I guess I got a different recipe for that. I didn't even see that. Boiling pot. Boiling pot. You know what? I'm not gonna fiddle around too much with these rarity ones. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna make them for... Okay. I'm gonna make them for when they show up and for, for later. There we go. Okay. Okay. The th I don't really know what these are, but I assume because they have no tags, I can basically add anything I want to them. Well, they're only selling one, so... Why not? Fuck it, why not? Just give me them. New recipe. Oh, it's a recipe! Oh! Oh, it's a recipe. Oh, now I see. Very appealing from color to flavor. So with all of those on a cutting board, that's a high price too. And then that one's super spicy. Oh, okay. I was wondering why they were blank. Cicada, lamprey. I'll get the sparrow sake. Yeah, that's that's uh, that's worth a pretty penny. Considering how much I bought that recipe for, I'm gonna make a lot of that, huh? I think I missed the window for the sparrow sake. Fuck. It seems like it's uh, within an hour time. Let me get some more meat. Okay. Did it say it was a recipe? I didn't even notice. Boar meat. I don't need too much in the way of meat, but I like having a disposable, uh... Well, not disposable, but I like having a bunch of ingredients. Okay. Radish potato. And give me that sweet trout. Okay. Alright. Let's go. Let's take a look. Okay, so now my recipe has, like, doubled up. But I can still only put four things on the menu. Hmm. They're pricey. But... I can tell based on the number how many I can make, so I can only make nine of these. I can make four of these, but it's not even counting the fact that the ingredients cross over, so I need to be careful about that. So let's just go with, uh, let's go with the, the, the tried and true lineup, I suppose. But instead of, uh, instead of fresh tofu, let's go with the boiled tofu and the rice ball, so I can use the steamer twice over. Okay, I like that. I didn't mean to hit that button. Good thing it stopped me. Okay, and put the tea on the menu. Um, it's, it's pretty pricey. Hmm. Hmm.
Hmm. Low alcohol. This is the menu that the regular guests order off of. So let's just go with the regular stuff. And then the sparrow sake. And then... Yeah, not the steamer, not the steamer, not the steamer, not the steamer. Okay. Okay, that's fine. We'll do that. Okay. Hmm. And so it begins. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Hey, how you doing? Okay, the boiling pot. Just get a basic for everyone. One of everything on the menu to put in storage. And I have the, yep, I have those already made. And of course, it was the one I didn't make. Just a raw block of tofu can make. Okay, something else, but I can't, I don't have the recipe for it, apparently. Okay. I love that one. <laughs> I don't even have to move. Whoosh! Alright, now we wait. <laughs> Whoosh! I can make a ton of rice balls. And I remember, I gotta give the, the right dishes to the rare customers when they show up. So I'll do that first and foremost, each time. Okay. Whoosh! This is it, Luigi. Alright, I'm not gonna make any more backup food, because once the rare customers start coming in, I'm not really gonna need it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. What you want, what you want, what you want? Rice ball? I got you. Take the shit. But they ordered the expensive sake too. Nice. Whoosh. Whoosh. I'm afraid I can't keep track of like the mooks interests. I can easily look it up, but it's a lot of effort. I'm just gonna go with what they want right in my face. Enjoy! I'm just waiting for the, the big spenders to show up. But Miss Dia will still serve all of her customers. What do I have right now? A skewer and a seaweed broth. Miso soup and lamprey. Nice. Oh, the rare, the rare girl's back. Oh, okay, okay. I don't have any info on you, do I? Sweet cuisine and a fruity beverage. Okay. Sweet. She wanted meat before, right? Let's try, uh, let's try that. Maybe that'll work. That worked out. It's like popular stuff, okay? I'm gonna introduce every single person in my world. Yeah, it's a funny story about that one. <laughs> oh. 
I want dreamy cuisine and a dry beverage. Dry is sparrow sake. Dreamy, huh? I can't make dreamy. I don't have any ingredients for that either, do I? Dreamy, dreamy, dreamy. Let me just take a peek at a... Let me see. Meat, sweet, trendy, and dreamy. She wants dreamy, but I don't have that. I have the recipe for that, but I don't have anything to make that, because I don't have the steamer or the frying pan available right now. So I can just give her a meat sweet and uh, another rice ball. Meat sweet popular, but I don't have anything that adds a dreamy thing to it, huh? I'll take another look, just in case. Uh, no. Okay. I won't get a perfect score for that, but it helps. No, the, the the recipes I bought from her were definitely dreamy. So that one, I can't give her exactly what she wants, but I can at least give her her other preferences. I don't have the steamer or the frying pan available. I still can only fit two, three things on there. Okay, Wriggle's here now. Oh. Dreamy and fruity, okay. Well, we're doing the same thing again. Iceable beverage. Okay. Oh, thank you? What do you mean, thank you? You wanted that, didn't you? Wriggle likes raw... Good for Wriggle. It said to give it to her, so I gave it to her. Huh. Aquatic cuisine and a sweet beverage. Okay. Abnormal food, low alcohol beverage. Sweet aquatic. Okay. Aquatic and sweet. We'll do that for Wolf Girl. And that was sweet beverage. Oh yeah. Strange food with low alcohol beverage. Okay. I already forgot. Uh, sweet, strange, meat, raw. Okay. Uh, sweet, raw, meat, strange. Yeah. Why did she not want it? Dreamy cuisine, iceable beverage. Okay. I can't make dreamy cuisine. So... Here, same deal. Tasks fulfilled. Have Wriggle try out do runny egg in your izakaya. I did it. She didn't like it, but I fulfilled the task, so okay, whatever. Whoosh. Yeah, good enough. No to abnormal food, low alcohol beverage.
Strange and sweet. Okay. Both of them go against her likes. Okay, but the but it was required. There was a task required for it. So even though she didn't want it, the game told me to give it to her. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I already forgot what she wanted. Sweet strange meat raw. Sweet strange meat raw. Sweet strange meat raw. Okay. More ingredients. Chen and Roomba didn't show up. The wolf girl did. Okay. Oh my god. Abnormal food and an iceable beverage. Okay. The more expensive the food, the more they can afford it. But here, take this. Surely that'll work. Okay, that works. Her card stops working when it's time to close shop. Be nice if she showed up earlier in the day, you know? Bye, Regal. Hope you like those fucking eggs, you idiot. And my items expired because Chen and Rumia didn't show up. Shit. What a pain in the ass. Ah, <laughs> plagued by deteriorating vision. An old yokai is looking for someone to hang lanterns along the yokai trail. Okay. Let's not make anything just yet. Let's go outside first. Hey, Kyoko. What is a sparrow tune? D good question. Guess we'll never know. Confirm by. Okay. Hey, Regal. How'd you like that egg? Have you tried my runny eggs? How was it? Taste and everything? Hmm, very commendable for a newbie. You f liar. Hooray! Glad to hear. To be honest, I thought you were joking with the whole Izakaya business. I didn't expect how serious and dedicated you would have become. My mom didn't raise a quitter. I will prove my resolution to everybody. Such spirit, as expected of the Great Fireflies BFF. <laughs> Want to check out some adorable bugs? Invite. Spend 30 minutes. 30 minutes of bug time? Hold on. New friend, bugs not included. Okay, we are now friends. Nice, there's the sparrow sake. I got a mushroom? Oh shit. Okay. Still have to feed her things. Um, inventory is still pretty good on that. I'd like more tofu, just in case. Eggs are important. Eggs are very important. Actually, what was the required for the stinky chili peppers and tofu? So I need more chili peppers, that's the problem. You're not selling any chili peppers. Oh. I'll just buy up your tofu stock. Why not? Rumor didn't visit. Fuck. Well, I gotta make them again. Uh, yeah, I can invite. I can invite Wriggle out. I'll do that. But first, the side quest. Is this the HOA for the Go Yokai Trail? I hate the homeowners association. Cough. Ah, uh, hello. My name is Misty. I saw that in the Boom Boom newspaper. You needed help. Not bad, most youngins nowadays don't want to volunteer anymore. Why bother heading into the Yokai Mountain if you can't even acknowledge your roots on the Yokai Trail? And also messing with those spell cards, they have no focus nor commitments. Oh no, he's going non-stop! Oh, speaking of uh, those lanterns that need to be hung up, I'm go get getting them right away. Okay. This strictly follows the recipe of Solus. 
What? Hang a lantern on pole besides Night Sparrow Hut, but on the bridge, fifty dollars, eight bizarre rocks, and recipe for roasted mushroom. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, there we go. One. Two. Three. Uh. Uh. Huh. You know what? Fuck, give me that. Okay. Four. Five. Is there another one? Oh, that's all of them. Okay. I need to report that I already hung up all the lanterns. Not bad, not bad at all. You're a quick one, aren't you? However, I still have to remind you that quick temper still has its drawbacks. For example, last year, just having to remember that I left the stove on. I need to turn it off ASAP. Wait, wait, alas, youngins nowadays. My stove. All right, well, now I'm going to remake my recipes. So let me do that real quick. I could make one of these just in case, but I don't know if I want to do that. So I'm just going to make the usual again. Okay. Maybe I make one just in case. Just one. Just one. So now I have those just in case. They might not even show up though. That's the problem. If they don't show up, I, it just goes to waste. I'd like to find some chili peppers. And I can get mushroom out of the dew trees. Alright. Alright, Riggle, wanna do some wanna do something? Would you would you, excluding your bugs, like to come over and have dinner? Are you inviting me while looking down on my swarm? Wishful thinking. <laughs> you know that's not what I meant. Pretty please? Mm, I'll think about it. Chat. Riggle, Riggle, now what? Could you come out less often during the daytime? I already am. Hey, why should I? Yeah, right, a customer complained to me just now. They said they found a cricket by the kitchen. That has nothing to do with me. Oh, I didn't realize. Wriggle, wriggle, now what? Could you come out less often during the day? Oh, hold on. Wriggle, wriggle! Huh? You coming to bite my head off or what? Prank or whatever, could you leave my customers alone? Excuse me, a customer was complaining to me that countless centipedes are crawling under their roof. How does that even relate to me? Wriggle, wriggle, what? Why did you mark that giant boulder by my storefront as your territory without telling me first? What boulder? I would never use something like that. Really? I was moving it away then. There were a gazillion bugs underneath. Ew! Why would you blame that on me? I didn't do it. Let's have a chat with my good friend Riggle. Let's just accuse her of all bug-related shenanigans. Are you hurt? Don't bother me. You okay? I'll help you. No, no need. Whoa, that's a deep cut. What kind of beast did this? But the claw mark isn't that big. <laughs> stray cats. You got scratched by stray cats. Don't laugh. The friendship meter went up with Riggle. Whoops, ouch. Why did you smash head first into that tree? It's because I didn't see it. And don't make it so dark you can't see. Nope, nope, nope. It hurts my eyes. Even just a little bit of light makes it through. You hate sunlight that much? Whenever I'm exposed to sunlight, my palms get sweaty, knees weak, and arms heavy. Ah, oh, my skin feels itchy already, head's just empty, I'm nervous, and on the surface I can't be calm and ready! Hold up! If you don't stop, we'll get a cease and desist! Not to mention you're feeling that probably because you lack some nutrients. Romeo, please. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm ready. Man, I would love some more guest tables. Okay. Well, that requires a cutting board. Which means I would have been able to make it. It's just not on the menu, so I couldn't fast make it. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what the recipe is. Uh, hmm. It's 
pricey. Can make a 17 of them things. It's a lot. You think about it. Cutting board too. I could make. I could put this on the menu too. Yeah, I can run the cutting board actually uh, as like the main attraction. So lamprey is the signature, of course. But I'll put in the fish, the rice ball, and the uh... mm, maybe not that yet. Maybe maybe I maybe I keep it on the tofu for now. The pot. I did that again. Whoops. Grill, cutting board. So what did I just? Ditch, essentially. Um, the tofu, right? I think so. That's fine as it is. Go with that. We'll go with uh, we'll go with this, this, and this on the menu. That's pricey. Okay, I'm ready. Let's hope that the right people show up this time. By the way, Misty, every every guest has their own preferences. It's also important to collect this information. No problem. I got it all in my notes. Take a look for yourself. I knew it. I want to see that the part about me. Ah, don't look. I'm gonna call her a medium speed worker. Ho 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 ho. Keep it nice and slow. Rice ball and tea. Oh, mushroom. Fungus. Fine mushroom collected from the forest of magic and able to cultivate it artificially, which makes it very precious. Nice. Hmm. Udon? That sounds like Usa. Must be palatable. Alright, Riggle. Show up early. Attract customers more than I can handle. Preferably, I just see uh, the same rare customers. This only takes one, uh, like, yeah, one trout, which I have a ton of. It's pretty good. Why does chopping board a thing on that anyway? That's weird. I don't understand what that tag means. That's just referring to the thing I need for it? it takes a bit of time to prepare. There you go. Okay. Well, I have one already pre-made, but it's now on my regular menu anyway, so I'll just use the pre-made one as soon as I can. Hmm. Woo! Stinky. Not sweetie, not fruity. Just stinky. On it, chief. That's a pricey meal when you think about it. <gasps> Roma! Okay. Bitter beverage and specialty dish. Well, I mean, you're not getting the specialty dish, but you get the bitter beverage. All right, Ruma, feel free to hate me, but you wanted it, so it's yours. Very tasty. All right, we'll take it. There you go. The stinky tofu. You think they would like the recipe they give you, but I guess I have to add shit to it. Boiled tofu. And a green tea. Very cheap, very cheap. Very expensive, Douglas. Wait, Ruma's gone? Oh, no! <laughs> she dipped! Alright, well now I just need Chen to come by. Preferably that wolf girl too, so I can not waste what I made there. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Rice ball. Mm. 
Nice. Tortetsu feast. Oh, this is this will be helpful with more customers in line. Rice ball again. Okay. Two rice balls actually. Okay. Rice ball again. Damn, this dude is just like inhaling this shit. You done now? There you go. Sit down, you bastard. The vibe is great. Decide quickly while my buff is still in effect. I still have the silly food. I need more lamprey again. Oh, patience freeze. That buff will be very handy once uh, things get more, things get busier. I got hyper mode. Hiya! Oh, don't have to sing while I'm in hyper mode. Yep, there we go. Whoosh! This is it! How convenient. Boog! Bro, she really showed up at closing time. She really showed up at closing time. Abnormal food and low alcohol beverage. Okay. Okay. Meat. Honey strange. Oh, I ran out of the, I ran out of the good shit. Uh oh. Sorry. What in the world did you serve? Uh, food. Fucker. Raw meat tastes better than cooked meat. Are you going to the weird other orders? Well done, steaks. I want an iceable beverage. I ran out of the blue goo. Everybody wanted it. Iceable. Raw meat, huh? Huh. Well, let's just give her the same, I suppose. Actually, let me just double check that. Raw. Yeah, raw and meat. Drains, meat, raw. Okay. Fish. I didn't think I'd run out of Mio. I really didn't. <laughs> I thought my Mio would be okay. But I, I actually sold out of it like instantly. Poor guy. Oh, Wriggle. Same thing. Same thing. Same thing. If I could give her a more expensive dish, I would, but this is fine. <laughs> wee, 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 wee. Would you like to spend more money, Riggle? Yes, you would. You want the exact same thing. Low alcohol beverage. I wonder, what if I give you this? 
but I combine it with all the same shit. It doesn't become a small portion anyway. Yeah, fuck it. She's gonna eat real fast. Okay. Hmm. Here you go, Riggle. T here's your chopped fish, but not actually fish anymore. I added meat to it. <laughs> You're still hungry. All dishes can be sweet. Low alcohol beverage. I feel like I'm going overboard with the requirements. And maybe I just have to give the give the tag she's matching to. I really don't know. Chad, am I going overboard with the uh, included tags? Or am I okay? Like, should I just give her the one that she's asking for and nothing else? Because I feel like I'm just blowing through ingredients by giving her everything she likes instead of just what she's specifically asking for. I can't tell, though. Alright. Expired cuisine. There we go. Damn, yeah, I really served all of my meal. You get bigger tips. Oh, I see. Yeah, look at my tips. I got 213 in tips alone there. So the more tags, the better the tips. Makes sense, makes sense. I understand. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, all right. Chen still didn't visit. Misty, what is it, Kyoko? Well, the deadline for the debt is due at the end of this week. Is everything okay? Uh, of course everything's okay. So stop worrying, cheer up. If it wasn't for me, if it wasn't for Kyoko, my business would never grow at this rate. With so many guests, I can't memorize who ordered what, but thanks to you reminding me all the time, I could. And you've taught me a lot of stuff. Misty, yeah, I'm sure everything will be all right. There's a week left and I'll work extra hard. That's more like it. Show me your fighting spirit. All right, our day begins now. What about that sparrow? Nope. Nope. I don't care about that sparrow tune. Let me see if I can get some more mushrooms. Let's get some mushrooms. Badgers, 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 badgers. The sparrow sake, of course. Um, Riggle wants to talk. What do you want to talk about, Riggle? Misty, Misty! Fried cicadas? Oh, God. What's the matter? You look glowing with excitement. Be grateful, I have brought you some goodies! Riggle. By goodies, you don't mean there's some new species of bugs, right? Not this time. But I'm not happy how you put it. Insects are highly noble creatures. You should be more respectful of them. Yeah, but not everybody likes them. What's more, I run a dining business. People will question my izakaya sanitation if they see bugs around. Hmm. You don't know how filthy humans and yokai can be when compared to certain bugs. Back then, we were... Cut, cut, stop walking down memory lane right there. I don't have all day. So if not bugs, what are the goodies? Oh, that certainly is a delicacy. Look, a freshly molted... Wow, what is that? It looks disgusting. Get it away from me. Hey, at least give it a chance. You told me it's not a bug. It looks like a bug of some sort of no matter how you look at it. It's called a cicada slow, not a living bug. It's a shell of a black cicada after it molted. The inside is empty. Try to poke it yourself. You're right. Even if it's technically not a bug, is it really any better, though? Ah, you infuriate me! Cicada slows are medically proven to be beneficial to the throat and eyes. See how useful that they can be? Not to mention freshly molted ones are even better. Feel this freshness and this crispness! Well, I don't want my adorable little bug's hard work to go to waste. Molting is a tough process, yet the shells have nowhere to go afterwards. I want you to cook them and educate people how beneficial us bugs can be. Uh, cooking with... this. Huh. Only ignorant people doubt this. You can't fry a slow wrong even if you try, so it's an easy and healthy snack, guaranteed. Okay, I guess I'll give it a try. Ch wriggle, wriggle, now what? <laughs> okay, let's see, so I got a new recipe. Fried cicada shells in a frying pan. Greasy and inexpensive and strange. Molten shells of cicadas are used as medicine to clear the throat and improve eyesight. It becomes crispy after frying and quite popular. Anyone ever try that before? That doesn't sound very good. Ugh, yucky. Alright. Chen still hasn't shown up. 
All right, I need I really need this person to start selling me some chili peppers. I'm buying more eggs Can't go wrong with eggs uh, I need my drinks again I'm gonna buy your entire stock of that Eh, fuck it. Give me it all. Why not? Okay Thank you Ruma, talk to me. Ruma, how'd you like my stinky tofu? Good morning! I still can't believe it. There's a dish in this world that smells horrible, but tastes amazing. Looks like people liked it. Right, I had to really talk myself into trying it the first time. Maybe this is what they meant by Gensokyo inclusivity. You here to play with me? I'm here to talk. Today is so hot. It's pretty cool in here. New friend, the flying dark orb. Do you want to sit here with me? Sure, why not? Let me give it a try. It's so comfortable sitting in the shade on a hot summer day. Because without sunlight, there's no heat! The only downside is it's too dark in here. Even the yokai who can summon darkness can't see anything in here. Losing vision, it puts people on edge. Is that so? Do people feel the same when they, I use my ability on them? Don't know! However, I'm happy even if I can't see anything. Have you been eating a balanced diet recently? Do you want to come to my izakaya tonight? I'll prepare something just for you. Oh, you can invite them and they're guaranteed to show up. Oh, I see. I'm eating pretty well recently. I haven't made up my mind where I want to go tonight. So th you can use 30 minutes to invite your friends to come visit your izakaya. Oh, that's what that meant. I thought it meant we were going to go hang out and do fun stuff. Oh, I can't do anything with Chen yet because she hasn't come naturally. Sheweed. I want some lamprey. Well, if I can guarantee good business by inviting... Can I only invite one at a time? Would you, excluding your bugs, like to come over for dinner? You invited me or looking down on my swarm, wishful thinking. Alright, so for... Yeah, so for 30 minutes you can... I guess you can guarantee they show up? That's good, because the rare customers are definitely the best ones. If Riggle shows up early, that's helpful. And Rumia and Chen bestow ingredients on me, so they're good too. The only problem with Riggle is she always likes to show up fashionably late. So... I never actually get... I never actually get, like, most of the benefits that come with her, uh, her actually arriving. Okay. Okay, I need to get... I want more lamprey for the lamprey stuff. God, I would love to be able to put all of my gear, though, so I could make everything. Okay. Oh, shit, I forgot to prepare. Actually, I don't need to prepare anything, because Chen's dish is the only one left. And she, uh... What do you call it? I can make hers with the cutting board, anyway. So let's go with the classics, the rice ball, that... Uh, cicada shells with a frying pan. Inexpensive. Greasy and strange and inexpensive. You know what? I need to do that anyway. I might as well. So I'll do that this for, for today. And then I'm putting the tea on the menu. Put the fruity highball, the sparrow sake, and the fruity sour. I'm going to keep the mio off the menu just in case. And I will put the grill, the cutting board, and the frying pan in place. Alright. Alright. It's alright. I need to give the uh, cicada shells to, uh, to, to Riggle, and I need to give, uh, I need to give the dried sardines to Chen. And I can, I can make the, I can make the, the dreamy thing with the cutting board. I just need to remember how to make it, so I just have to look at the recipe. So I can make everything I need to make without what, potentially wasting ingredients again. So I'll be okay with this. Okay. Mistia's- Mistia's lamprey in actual canon is like very highly regarded by uh, yokai. Like even the high-ranking yokai. She's a good cook. She's really good at what she does. She just has some less than honest methods of getting- attracting the customer base. <laughs> but her food is top-notch. I've never heard of some of these drinks, but I'm not a drinker. I don't know anything about alcohol, like, at all. Mio sounds like one of those drinks that's mixed, so it's more soda than alcohol content, so I'd probably like it. All 
Nice. This game is really nice. It's very cozy. I see why this game is very popular. I do. I mean, it's been three hours and I don't want to stop. <laughs> so that's that's pretty telling, I'd say. <clears throat> Please just order green tea, guys. Patience freezes on, which is, that's fine. I'm done. No, the debt was paid off at this point. I need 3,000 and I'm, my, my budget is hovering over that, even with all the stuff I bought. I'm good. So everything I make is now extra surplus, essentially. So I'm okay. I'm more than okay. Okay. Still got like five days left after this, I believe. Rice ball. I don't think I let go of that in time. Shit. Well, it didn't turn to dark matter, so it's okay. Oh, you like that one quite a lot. Chen! Please show up, Chen. The rice ball, huh? Just wriggle. Actually, uh, what can I add to this? She doesn't like mild or vegetarian. So I guess I can just add... It comes naturally as strange. So let me just add the raw meat. Yeah. Let's just do that. There you go. Okay. Low alcohol. Give her on the secret menu. There you go. And a rice ball. Nice. Firefly Phenomenon at the halfway point is pretty good. It's pretty good. Okay. Now, if only I had Tortetsu's buff on. Uh, meat tastes better than... Okay. Raw meat, low alcohol beverage. Low alcohol, low alcohol. Give another Mio. Give another Cicada with the works. Okay. Yakitori. Okay. Get that going. Pick that up. There you go, Wriggle. Nice. Oh, Rare Girl's there. Rare Girl's there. Uh, If she wants something dreamy, I gotta give it to her. Meat cuisine and iceable beverage. Actually, she likes she likes trendy stuff, right? Trendy meat and sweet. This will satisfy her. I forgot her drink though. Iceable. Meat, low alcohol beverage. Same deal, same deal. Low alcohol, low alcohol. Give her the Mio. Okay. Okay. Ruma is here. Ruma has arrived. Whoosh! Aquatic cuisine, sweet beverage. Sweet beverage, okay. Sweet beverage. Aquatic cuisine. With uh, a little bit of... 
What was it? Meat and sweet, right? Meat and sweet? Meat and sweet. Okay, aquatic cuisine with meat and sweet. Yeah. Rice ball, can't make that on the cutting board right now. Give me a second. Yoosh! Insect, abnormal food, low alcohol beverage. Aquatic dry beverage. Aquatic. Aquatic dry beverage. Meat and sweet. Dry beverage. Dry beverage. Okay. Throw that. Okay. Low alcohol. Give me that. Okay. Oosh. Number three, sweet cuisine, dry beverage. Sweet, 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 sweet meat, sweet meat. And a rice ball and what was that other one? Dry beverage. Sparrow sake, right? Yes. Oosh. Regular rice ball. Dried sardines. Okay. Whoosh. Meat cuisine, iceable beverage. Sparrow sake. Meat. Fish. Sweet on the meat. Okay. And then a rice ball. Come on, come on, come on. And then a rice ball. Hoi, oi, oi. Whoosh. Oh, my buff ran out. Oh, fuck. I gotta go hand deliver it. <laughs> All right, nice. Roomba eight, I think. Wait, did she leave the line? Oh no, she didn't. <laughs> no, she did, right? I'm pretty sure she did. I'm pretty sure I fed her. I gave her something, I think. I'm almost positive I did. She showed up. No, she left? She left? No! <laughs> Chen still hasn't come back. She was next in line, then it closed? Oh, no! <laughs> Some yokai claims you've seen a suspicious meeting at the yokai trail. Okay. Hmm. So, what do you think of my recipe? Fried cicada slows? Uh, the appearance of this dish made it a bit difficult to sell at first. How come? But there are some daredevils sometimes. Those brave ones who tried the dish say it's unexpectedly crunchy. Then more and more people started asking to try the slows. After some time, it's now widely accepted with many positive reviews. The slows are the solid proofs that my dear bugs sweat in tears. I'm glad to know the public appreciated us. Now, if you consider bugs as pets, they don't shed at all. Wiggle, you look very busy recently. Yeah, I was motivated because I saw how much fun you had when you dedicated yourself to the Izakaya. Quite the high spirit. What's the plan? To improve the social status of insects, I plan to conduct a service called Buggy Notification. Buggy Notification. When your calendar event is closing up, I'll let you my charming swarm remind you of it. You see, to ensure diversity within the service, customers can choose between winged insects, mini-legged insects, legless larvae. Oh dear, that sounds horrible. Sorry, I don't mean your bugs, but it's still terrifying. 
About ingredients. What's the ingredients tab do? Before I do that, I need to look around. I want to get my morning dew stuff. See if I can get some mushrooms. Get some mushrooms. Chen, could you like hurry up and visit my establishment? Jesus. She won't, she won't show up. New product? I don't care about your new product. I just want... I want all of your alcohol. And your egg. And your pork. And your beef. Your tofu. Yeah, it's fine. I'll take that. Thank you. Wait, you're not... What? Room of your darkness is pretty popular among yokai around here. Hey, that's because of that Tengu's newspaper. There are always yokai trying to sneak into my darkness during the day. You're the only one here right now? After I smashed my face through a tree several times, they all left in disgust. Oh. Hello, sir. My name is Mistia. I saw your post in the Boomer Winter newspaper. Came to help you. Oh, aren't you the owner of the Izakaya? Okay, let me explain. I heard there's a new animal spirit organization. They're just a group of lost dead souls. We can't tolerate them and let them have their way. Could you check for me if there's anything less suspicious after the party? They have frequent parties at the south side of the Yokai Trail. Looks like this guy just wants to scavenge but is afraid to do it himself. Okay, sure. I'm rich. Chen, can you come visit my establishment, please? Alright. I found some stuff. Yo, check out the stuff I found. Check it. Dasai! Found these three bottles. Let me see. Doesn't look valuable at all. Hm, they're indeed poor, lost, and dead souls. He left. However, this taste tastes like alcohol. Hm, in that case, I'll just... What? Here in Village City, operating at midnight, the shops essentially only serve a yokai by late night. This is a well known secret. I heard there's a spirit bought in the yokai trail that gives you completely unnatural alcohol in the morning. It would be great if I could find it. Completely natural alcohol. Well, yeah, that's the sparrow sake, right? Ooh ha. Thank you for that. Uh, hmm. I'll just buy up your stock on that. No, 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 put it... Give me it. Okay. Uh, let me see. Well, I got das, uh, dasai. Pork bowl? Oh, what? Okay, now I have a new ingredient. Ingredient? No. I have a new, uh, <laughs> I have a new recipe. Wait, you can make that with a cutting board too? Oh. Expensive. Wow. Well, I got a lot of shit now, don't I? I don't even know where that came from. Ruma, come eat at my establishment. Please. You didn't get to eat last time. I'm not gonna invite Riggle this time. I'm only inviting... I'm only inviting... I want ten! I can't invite Chen until she shows up naturally and tries my dried sardines. Ooh, stuff. Dasai. That must be a drink, right? Um, X button. Should be in beverages, yeah. One of the treasures of the Kiketsu family. It randomly got this name because Otter Spirits placed enemy loot on the floor resembling a ritual. It's actually a high quality sake. Oh. Alright, sure. That's pretty good. I mean, that's that's some like secret menu level stuff. I don't have enough to put it on the menu. Uh, what else do I want to do here? Do I want to prep anything ahead of time? Not really. I'll just roll with that. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. All right, that's fine. Let's do it. Back to business. Okay. I kind of like that lineup, honestly. So signature dish. Rice ball. I still need this for Chen. And the cicada slows are a little weird, but they work well for both Rumia and uh, Riggle's palate because they come naturally with Strange. So, 
Oh, but I do have the pork bowl, which comes naturally with meat, but I guess that's because meat isn't a greedy, but I can only make nine of them. And if I really need to, I'm not using the steamer, actually. I'm using the frying pan. Never mind on that. Uh, so go with the tea. Uh, fruity highball. The Mio and the Sparrow Sake. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. And then... Grill, cutting board, frying pan. Okay, I'm ready. Just wait till I can have more sh uh, stuff on the menu. I have five slots for food? S what? Since when? What? Well, I still only have- I still- it doesn't really matter. I still only have like three slots for cooking equipment. Slow is pronounced slough? What? Why? <laughs> what? At Jen, you're early today. Please wait a bit. We're still setting everything up. Have a seat first. I'm not here to eat. Then why are you... Did you get... Did I get the dates wrong? There's a deadline already? Misty, calm down. There's still a week left. It's not still a week left. It's only a week left. Tough is pronounced tough. I... I guess. I guess. <laughs> it won't be long before the deadline arrives. Why is your business still just lukewarm? As long as the deadline's not due, how is this any of your business? Hmm. Speaking of which, I'm here to give you some advice. You can't pay the debt. Am I not the one who must bear the loss? By advice, you mean, hey, Misty, you can't trust her. Well, we might as well hear what she has to say. Come on, you train at a Buddhist temple, yet your temper is as ranted as the voice. How annoying. The only one I don't want to hear this from is you. You try to make a fortune merely with a cart. How long would that take? Our family's on good terms with a yokai who's good at construction. And we can help you renovate the place that way you can attract more guests. More guests, you say? Can you really say no to this fabulous deal? Won't you get more income if you have more guests? But Misty is our only cook. There are more guests. Misty not be able to handle them all. Well, then it depends on how determined you are. A bigger storefront means more traffic and any more income. If you can't take it anymore, you can go back to using the poor little cart. Decide for yourselves. You want to work hard and make some real money? Or are you satisfied with slowly boiling frogs? <laughs> boiling the frog? I've never tried. Misty, I think she's referring to the experiment of boiling the frog in warm water. Eh? Does that mean I must use warm water to boil frogs? Forget about frogs! Frogs are never the point! I requested a yokai construction team to help you with a new design of your izakai. Shouldn't you thank me? But switching to a new cart all of a sudden. There's no need to miss the small food cart, it's there! Didn't I just say changing to a bigger storefront means more pressure and only the only cook we have is Misty? What if I told you you can freely choose the size of your izakai before you start work every night? Doesn't sound great? Huh? There's a yokai who could achieve such a thing? Impressive. Alright, does that settle all your doubts? Why are you trying to help us? This feels fishy. Uh, of course, it's so that I can make sure you pay off your debt. I'm giving you a free trial for this time only, but don't ever, don't ever think of getting another free trial like this in the future. Well, if you say so, we might as well try it out. You still have a brain, it's not a small project. I'm really letting you off this time. If you want to further expand your Yuzakai, you'll have to pay renovation fees. Oh, I may have a favor or two that you can't refuse. No, 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 not for me. It's for the Yokai construction team and for my kitties. Well, we should have no problem if it's just that. Yeah, so we'll trust her this time. Well then, we'll try it out tomorrow. Tomorrow? No, today! Well, I mean, you can't whip that up into today. That's fine. I wonder why you can, like, discard. I guess if I really fuck up. What you want? <laughs> Put it on the table, immediately rip it from them. Right out of their face. So they want more meals, their hearts go up. And I guess the higher their heart, the, uh, the more they tip. Yeah. Seven dollars. A tip of two. This is my stand. This is a really cozy environment, though. You know? Like the outside stand. I can't say if I've ever eaten in this kind of situation. Well, I have a campgrounds, I suppose, with like ice cream and hot dogs, but... This just feels really comfortable, comfortable, I suppose. If you ignore, like, the potential, like, boogs everywhere, I guess. Could you really run a storage space? You get a lot to work with. There's 24 spots in there. Hmm. 
She carries this whole cart with her. Wow. Suddenly boog. What you want, Riggle? Low alcohol beverage. I don't want what's on the menu. Strange, raw, sweet, with some meat. Not the beef, actually. The beef is more expensive. Actually, the shit, the boar meat is actually pretty expensive. Maybe I should just be using pork. Yeah, it's fine. Whoosh! Whoosh! Aha! Rice ball. Man, I love just being able to toss things. And the firefly effect is very pretty. Same deal. I'm gonna make her the exact same thing. Raw sweet with some meat. Okay. Your fried eggs still count as raw? I I don't know. Apparently. Chen! Oh shit! Rice ball. Okay. Riggle is immediately on that shit. All dishes were sweet with low alcohol beverage. People are the exact same thing. Raw sweet with some meat. Okay. Cats eat fish in a dry beverage. Alright. Aquatic, salty, savory. What was it that Chen liked again? Barbecued, greasy, and sweet. Barbecued, greasy, and sweet. I can't really add greasy. Wait, did that say sweet or was I like, crazy? Nope, sweet's there. So I can put some honey on this, uh, add some sweet to it. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, dry beverage. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> That's pricey. Okay. Sweet, iceable beverage. Okay. It's iceable. Oh, wriggle pay up. Time for Riggle to pay the big bucks. Fish and a fruity beverage. Okay. Fruity beverage. Not fruity. Okay. Aha! Rice ball. Oh. Alright, I've just exhausted Riggle's wallet. She's gone now. Whole budget's out. Cats eat fish in a fruity beverage. Maybe I can make something with... Well, I figured she'd like this, right? Let me see. Aquatic, barbecued, greasy. Aquatic, barbecued. Can I add fish to it? Grill and savory. I don't think that does anything. Sweet. I can. Oh, the lamprey with honey would be better in this situation, huh? Fruity. 
fruity beverage. Okay. Marissa. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. Get. I don't care about the vibe, dog. <laughs> Get out. We got a VIP. Oh, never mind. The older it gets, the more legendary it becomes. I want a low alcohol. The older it gets, the more legendary it becomes. So she wants something legendary, huh? Okay. Moves vegetarian, adds legendary mountain delicacy. Let's go with this, I suppose. See what she likes it. And what was it? Low alcohol beverage. Okay. Hope you enjoy this. There are too many witnesses to dine and dash. She loved it. Uh, rice balls. Thanks for the mushrooms. Alright. I feel bad shooing that guy away now, but I was I didn't want another I don't want her to leave before she ate. Goodbye, Marissa. <laughs> I don't know how much that cost her. Alright, yeah, time's up. Couple quick ones in there. Whoosh. All right. Oi, oi, oi. I'll take this moment to take a look. Marissa. Talkative human magician. She lives alone in the forest of magic, but she can make friends no matter what. Her friends include humans, yokai, fairies, and so on. Oh, she's also an expert when it comes to fungus. So she likes legendary, Japanese, and trendy items, and low alcohol. Wow, I really- I nailed her in one, uh... I nailed her in one... one recipe, huh? Her budget is insane, though! Damn! Look at that portly sum compared to Marissa. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, and Chen finally showed up. So once their bond level hits the max, they can basically get a new quest, I see. But Marissa only ate one meal, so I can't get any higher than that. But Chen can- okay, okay, okay. Uh... Marissa. Randomly obtain three mushroom ingredients. Occasionally we'll give you something rare. Wondering why Star creates mushrooms and why mushroom loving Marissa is willing to give mushrooms to you? You'll be unhappy. Alright. I broke my combo by shooing that guy away. I feel bad. Hmm. I, I, I should have looked at the time closer. As soon as I shoot him off, too, the other person got up and left anyway, so... <laughs> it was unnecessary. Oh. You know what? Fuck it. What is the tanuki like? Salty filling meat. Why not? Hmm. She did consider dine and dashing. Not bad. I need some more meat though. Okay. Nice. No expired cuisine. Everything look good. Nice. Perfect, 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 perfect. And now I got some more progress with, uh, with old, old Chennifer. For the peace of the human village and Yokai Trail, Yokai seems to be worrying over some important things at the Yokai Trail. The unlicensed Isekai at the Yokai Trail expands. Why do they keep calling me unlicensed? As the unlicensed Isekai has grown in popularity, has undergone an expansion. We interviewed the Hakode Shrine Maiden who noted that she would see it. She to it in her spare time. Oh shit, Reimu? 
You're coming to visit little old me? Little old me? Just some dew. Okay. Well, let's take a look around for the side quests and stuff first. Riggle's not at, uh, I have not bonded yet, but I can still talk to Riggle every day. To upper, upper. Hey, Riggle, what's up? Hey, nice time. I'm preparing for the Night of the Fireflies. There's a party for insects. Sort of, but our party does not focus on food or wine, but dances instead. Just imagine it. Fireflies dancing with their starry lights decorating the sky of midsummer night. Wow, they'll also make the evening more lively for sure. What is the ingredients tab? What is that? I didn't do that last time. Do and cicada. Not there yet. Okay. I wonder if that means she's somewhere on the trail. More do. Click it for fun? Oh, I can, yeah, but just let me get all my other stuff first. She's in the other gather point. Oh, I see. Okay. Hello there, you must be the proprietors of the Izakaya. How are you doing? Thanks for your business. I have to thank the Night Sparrow Izakaya for improving the dining quality of the entire Yokai Trail. Actually, I have a request specifically about that. I believe that there still exists man eating Yokai because they don't understand the wonder of authentic cuisine. Therefore, for the peace of the Yokai Trail, please make us some delicious cuisines with meat. What? Is it really that serious? I'll try my best. Coming to my Izakaya tonight. Give three cuisine with meat tags. The yokai is worried to death about something. Does anyone want to help? Please find the yokai trail. So just, okay. That seems pretty easy to do. That'll just happen naturally, right? My secret dried fish crisps are pretty good, right? Tolerable. You fool! You fell victim to one of the classic blunders! Nani? <laughs> that recipe must be your ultimate secret dish, right? You could have just ignored my taunt last time but by giving me a normal recipe. Ah! You! You! I, I knew it already! I'm doing you a favor right now, so you always owe me. Okay, okay, thanks again. That's right, you should thank me. Why are you asking me to do this, eh? Wait, when did you show up? Ah, so annoying. New pal, can't you just be candid? What's wrong, Wit Cat? We were hosting a kitty meeting just now. Some stupid human came and threw water on us and scared all the kitties away. That's pretty annoying. However, I didn't know that you were the kind of yokai that just takes a beating without giving anything in return. When I'm soaked, I can't do anything. What's wrong with being soaked? I would lose my ability to be possessed as Shikigami as soon as I'm soaked. At that stage, I'm no different from a normal yokai cat. Even a normal yokai cat has some self-defense capabilities. This is against Sokyo, after all. It's not like I don't have anything. I still have the ability to surprise humans. Turns out I was the one that was surprised. <laughs> what were you thinking? You were so focused you didn't even hear me calling your name several times. Mm, nothing. Why are you here? I got some fresh ingredients recently. I thought you might like them, so I'm here to ask if you want to have dinner in my izakaya tonight. Really? Then I guess I'll go there for a little while. Give me egg. I'd like to buy up all your meat. Thank you. Tofu is fine. Okay. There we go. Drinks are back in. Hello, Ruma. Tastes so hot. Okay. Uh, how's, how's friendship with Ruma? Very low at level 2. So I'd like Ruma to come to my, uh... Come to my, come to my shop. Come to my shop. I gotta feed meat tags. Uh, the expansion project, which will happen later. I'll do a, I'll see the gathering point. Riggle is currently my closest friend, yes. Have you bugs found any good loot recently? What do you think you are, scavengers? But do they pick up things here and there? You- Okay, okay, they found some ingredients lying around. I have a hunch these are useful to you. They're all yours. Gotcha, thank you, thank you. Oh, nice. Why did those bugs find meat? You know what? That doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, thank you. Thank you, Riggle. I gotta keep an eye on this area down here because I can find some of that really expensive alcohol. Hmm. Sparrow sake is not there currently. Did I miss it? Shit. I really don't want to miss that. It's pretty important. I wouldn't be using rotten meat though, right? Oh, nice. Lamprey. That's good. Still haven't really figured out to fully how to fully satisfy Chen's palate. 
Because I don't have ingredients that add, like, the kick she's looking for. You know? Like, she wants aquatic, barbecue, greasy, and sweet. I can get aquatic and barbecued and sweet. I can't get greasy, though, but if she does... Actually, wait, aren't the cicadas greasy? Uh... They are greasy. Oh, okay. No, I can cover everything. The grilled lamprey is aquatic and barbecued. And it, I can add honey and then I can do the cicada shells otherwise. Alright. Alright, hold on. My, my last grab here will be either... I'm gonna find alcohol. I like having the sparrow sake. It may not fly off the shelf, but it's 50, so it's pretty good if they want it. Alright, I'll settle with some herbs. Okay. According to Chen, it appears that level 2 storefront can be used tonight. Shown here is the level of storefront used at night. I can freely change what level to use. Level 2 storefront can accommodate more guests and more countertops and additional kitchenware. With more guests coming in, of course, there will be more profit. However, while bigger is a guy can attract more guests, the stress of managing will naturally increase. If it's too tough, you can always switch to the lower level and take it easy. Let's try level 2 for tonight. Actually, I have to pee real quick, chat, so just give me, give me like a minute. Be right back. All right, all right. Yeah, this game is uh really good, and I, I still want to play it. And it's been almost four hours, so I'm sorry to say, but there, <laughs> there's there's just no time for Tempest again tonight. But for for a different reason this time, I I, I, I just don't want to stop playing. <laughs> I don't want to stop playing this. It's really fun. Okay. All right. Six areas. Oh shit. Okay. Wait a minute. Rare customers doesn't specify Marissa down there. That's weird. Okay. We're opening the big the big boy today. So now I have a bigger menu. So I can put five things up there. So let me see. And I can put all of my kitchenware to use. So I basically need to put on my... the ones I can put the most on. Uh, so let's go with... You know, of course, the regular. The rice ball. The dried sardines. Um, the cicada shells. And... Um, I suppose... Can I look at the ingredients needed for that specifically? Expensive, western, sweet, cool, dreamy. It costs a lot if somebody wants it. But I think I'm going to go with the boiled tofu. So we'll go with that. Okay, and for drinks. So the tea, of course. And we'll just go with the... I don't actually have much sparrow sake, so I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to go with what I have the most of. Um, okay, and then I can just put the kitchenware... All the kitchenware is available to go. 
Okay. All right. All right. Let's give it a shot. This might be a bit hectic. Oh, nice stand. All right. There's the drinks. There's all the stuff. Can't do anything there. Food cabinet, of course. Discard area. Kyoko's there, too. All right. So if it's on the menu, I can instantly make it. Otherwise, I have to pull up the recipe and make it manually. I don't even have to see. I don't have any recipes for the steamer. Okay. Cicada, fruity ball. Okay. It's coming. Let me just make one of everything. Just as backup. Okay. Five rice ball. Okay. Okay. All right. Another yakitori. Whoosh. I got hyper mode already because of all the stuff I pre cooked. Oh, there's Riggle. All right, Riggle's gonna make this real difficult. <laughs> Rice ball. Okay. Okay. Sweet dish, low alcohol beverage. Okay. Low alcohol. Um. Sweet dish. So give her the usual. Raw sweet meat. The Wriggle special. Come on, come on, come on. Table six wants that. Okay. Wriggle, raw meat, low alcohol beverage. Okay. Low alcohol beverage. Uh. Surely that counts, right? Okay. Cicada in there. Get that going. Oh, fuck. That was terrible. Hope that doesn't turn to dark matter. Okay. There you go, Riggle. Okay. Oh, I already have boiled tofu in there. Whoops. Okay, I hope that doesn't go to waste. Uh, rice ball. Alright. Whoosh. Yakitori. Sorry, Lamprey. Okay. Chen's here. Rice ball. Rumi is here. Oh shit. Another rice ball for table three. Chen, could you, uh, uh, greasy, she wants greasy fruity beverage. Fruity beverage, greasy, okay. Greasy, greasy is cicada. Greasy is cicada with uh, aquatic. Does she want aquatic? Yes. Cicada with aquatic and sweet. 
Yes. It's not barbecued though, but that's fine. Make another one of those. Romeo. Uh, one of those freaky dishes humans want. Bitter beverage. Bitter, bitter, bitter. Bitter. Okay. That's bitter. Fruity highball is bitter as well. That's for Chen. Okay. This is also for Chen. Yep. Table five. Yakitori. Okay. Make another one of these. Gonna make another one as well. Rumia wants freaky dish. That would be cicada. Go with the raw, go with the sweet, go with the meat. Okay. Raw sweet meat, that's Rumi special. Okay. Get another one of those making. Okay. Get that to Rumi. Okay. Get another one making. Rice ball. Then go check out what Chen wants. Roast meat skewered on a stick with a fruity beverage. Okay. Fruity beverage. Okay. Okay. Nope. Roast meat on a stick. Roast meat on a stick. Uh, roast meat on a stick. Do I even have that available for you right now? I don't think so. Roast meat on a stick. Aquatic barbecued. I guess that's good enough for her with the honey. I'll go with that. Okay. Get the rice ball going. Boiled tofu. Nope. Boiled tofu's number three. Okay. No, that's Chen's, right? Yeah, that's Chen's. That's Chen's lineup. Rice ball for number five. Rumi, uh, fresh sweaty, something that's raw, bitter beverage. Sake. That's not dry, that's not bitter. That's bitter. Eat something raw. Cicada, strange, sweet, raw meat. Okay. Okay. Lamprey. Rice ball. Okay. Okay. Nope, oh, another rice ball. Hi yo. Oh. I'm running a lamprey, it seems. No. No. Number two. Yes. Rice ball. Number four. Their patience is unlimited with me right now, at least. Ice ball. I'm running out of lamprey, though. Yeah, this got pretty hectic fast, huh? Dried sardines. Do I make another one? That's boiled tofu. Yakitori. Okay. Not yakitori. I don't know how to adjust the aim of the, the free throw. That'd be nice if I could do that.
Hoi. One boiled tofu left over. Maybe somebody will want it. That would be nice, wouldn't it? They love the rice balls, man. Product is fine. Ha! Huh. Well, D-pad moves me. Maybe it, maybe it's the right stick. Holy shit! Okay, yeah, that one. Man, that was a lot. <laughs> that was a lot of food, sir. But I only lost one. 37 customers. Well, 37 meals, 29 customers. Wow. Hoi, oi, oi. Okay. No Marissa this time. I thought I saw somebody show up in line, but it would have been fine, right? I think I got, I completed a request. Uh. Unlicensed. Popularity is a gust of wind. Japanese food is no longer popular. Okay, that's fine. That should mean that my uh, rice balls have changed, right? Yeah, they're no longer they're no longer trending, so they, they lost that tag. I see. Okay. Regal, what's up? You had a cicada sl a sluffs already? Nah, I'm here to play. About time, you've been tending that shabby Izakai all this time. I almost died of boredom. Hey, sorry about that. It must be hard for you these days. I have to personally thank you and your bugs, but not for you. Fried cicada slows could never have stayed on the menu for as long. Mm, now you've earned, well, now you earn, you learn to respect us. Yes, yes, you are the best. I can't believe, I can't be in your debt forever, so do you have anything that you really want to eat? Maybe I could make it for you. Anything I want to eat. There is one that I've been craving for a very long time, but I'm afraid it's out of your league. Hey, you haven't even given me a chance. I will do my best. So many of us enjoy nectar, and you know this already. That's true. We used to worship a flower called Udumbara as the flower of our race. In ancient times, such flowers could be seen everywhere. Their nectar was sweet, but in a very gentle way. So during that period, our clan loved to make desserts using the nectar of Udumbara. <laughs> However, as the power of our clan declined, Udumbara gradually disappeared from the world as well. If possible, I'd love to taste Udumbara cakes once more. I see nectar cakes shouldn't be that difficult to make. <laughs> but where should I find a Udumbara if they are all gone? Actually, I recently heard some bugs say over that mountain deep in the marsh a glimpse of Udumbara was caught. Eh? Do flowers grow on a marsh? Udumbara is a resilient plant, therefore it was seen everywhere, but now the plunge in numbers of the flowers is just as mysterious as the sudden decline of our clan. That's probably the fate of the ones worshipped by the flowers of the insect race. Don't be sad, we can go pick you Dunbar up later with that new information. We not be able to do much with that info. If we fireflies need a clean water source, the swamp to us fireflies is. It's harder to even for me. Of course, it would be even harder for other bugs that have yet to become yokai. I see. But you don't need to feel sorry for me. If you Dunbar can bloom in a swamp, they must be as vigorous as before. Maybe there are more of them elsewhere. Riggle, yes, you are right. I will search for additional Udumbara with you in the future. The Udumbara existed for so long without being discovered because it's blooming in a secluded location. I should pay more attention to other small trails around here. Swampy. Chat. You look very busy. Yeah, it's motivated because I saw how much fun you dedicated yourself to Izakaya. Quite the high spirit. What's your plan? To improve the social status of insects, I plan to... Oh, that's buggy notification again. Okay. Bye, Riggle. Saraba! Thousands of different dishes in yokai. I'm chasing delicacies with right mind when I want to eat human flesh. It's rare to see many in yokai nowadays. Give three cuisines with meat tags. Didn't I do that? What? Oh, I have to. Oh, I have to give them it. Ow. Oh, that's. Okay. So I just gotta go make them. I got it. I got it. Well, first, let me grab the dew and the mushrooms. I don't see any alcohol. Chen has not... We have not bonded yet. We must bond. Stray cat went missing. It's no good. Ah, oh, wait a minute. Stray cats can't go missing. Why not? Ed, stray cats are cats without a permanent home, right? So what do you mean by missing? Even stray cats have a permanent den. 
There's a hidden village on the mountain. That's my kitty's den. Kitty den? As far as I'm aware, aren't cats mostly lone wolves? That's normally true. I got everybody around and allowed them to live at my den. Wait, looks like you didn't actually gather everyone because some of them went missing. <laughs> Stop giving her the runaround. Oh, finally, some chili peppers. Jesus. I'll take your entire stock! Yeah, that's good. Thanks, fucker. Let's talk with Ruma. Ruma doesn't have much to talk about, apparently. Okay, I need four meat dishes. But I can't add ingredients when I cook them, so they need to be, uh, they need to be specifically meat. Okay, let's see. What is specifically labeled as meat? Um... Three pork bowls, essentially. Okay. Let's use up an hour and a half on that. Okay, that's fine. Okay, four meat, pork. I thought it wanted me to serve it at the izakaya and not actually give it to them manually. It's the first time it's wanted me to do that. Here, take. There you go. Yeah. There, nice. Ah, ma'am, thank you very much. Cuisine at this level can definitely persuade these stubborn yokai. What are these bizarre rocks, dude? Maybe just maybe your cuisine can save the world. That's an overstatement. Honey, did I pick up the sparrow sake already? I think I did. Well, the day is like gone. How am I doing on stuff? Um, what do I need more of? I need lamprey. Oh god, I need lamprey. I I have to I have to find lamprey. I can't run out of my signature dish. <laughs> that would be bad. Oh, more of the good shit. Only one, though. Okay, that's fine. How's, uh... Let's see. Wriggle's at maximum bond for three, but we don't know where the flower is. Almost, almost good with Ruma. And halfway with Chen. I'm looking for some some flower in, like, a, in like a, a swampy, I suppose. But... That's pretty good. Uh... I can run level two again. I can run level two again. I am running low on eels, yeah, but I can I can afford to put it on the menu one more time. These have gone out of style. I used a lot of them. Uh, I'm gonna put fresh tofu on. Sardine. Uh, let's go with the runny egg and the cicada shells. That seems pretty good. Okay, and for drinks, you can put five drinks on the menu, so... I should be fine, I hope. And then all the cookware. Okay, let's see how well this goes. I should, I don't think I'm gonna sell 22 grilled lamprey, right? But although the question is, what am I, what's gonna be my best seller tonight? Because the rice balls are off the menu. <laughs> I think my cheapest menu item is the lamprey now, which... Mm, uh oh. Uh oh. Nothing in the boiling pot. Well, let's... Tofu for him. Okay. Okay.
Put one of everything in there. Let's back up. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oops. I double tap instead of holding it. Don't be dark matter. Not dark matter. Not bad. Okay. Chen needs to give me some fish. Oh, I didn't invite anybody, did I? Whoops. Oh, wait, Chen showed up anyway. Chen is on the scene. Should have invited Riggle, I guess. Okay. Uh, roast meat skewered on a stick and a dry beverage. I don't know if that counts. Dry. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. Did she like it? Yes, she did. Nice. Hmm. Cats eat fish and a dry beverage. Aquatic, salty, savory. Sweet. Dry beverage. Okay. Boiled tofu. Oh, this just can be sweet. Low alcohol beverage. Low alcohol. Sweet raw meat. Dry beverage and cats eat fish. make another one of these. Oh boy. Fish tofu. Tofu, tofu, tofu. I, whoops. Boiled tofu. Buttons. Insects can be carnivores. Low alcohol beverage. Okay. Low alcohol beverage. Low, low, low. Insects can be carnivores. I know, I know. Take your, take your thingy. You sweet. Uh oh. Sweet raw strange meat. Sweet, sweet raw meat. Okay. Okay. Whoosh.
There's a lot going on, huh? <laughs> Full stomach soda beverage. Okay. I lost the power. Full stomach soda beverage. Full stomach soda beverage. Uh, full stomach soda beverage. Filling. What was my filling item? Strange, inexpensive. Mild raw. Small portion, small portion. I had something that was filling somewhere in here. Which one was it? Uh, this is the rice ball. Rice ball with seaweed. Yep. Seaweed, raw, sweet, meat. Strange. That was Rumi's preference, right? Philly meat, raw, strange. Yep. Okay. Okay. Number six. Here's your thingy, Majiggy. Ruma, here's your meal. Yakitori. What's currently in here? Nothing anybody wants. No, 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 no. Hey. Get that on the fly. Get that going. Hey, number one and number two. Number two wants this. Number one wants the boiled tofu. It'll be faster. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ruma's done eating. Okay. Number four. Number five. Okay. Boiled tofu. Oh. Number six. Number two. Okay. Boiled oil tofu. Cicadas. Man, I wish I had two cutting boards. <laughs> Oil tofu. Boiled tofu. Uh yeah, take that. Take that. Another boiled tofu. Yes, yes. Toss. Ha! Oh. Done. <laughs> oh God, it doesn't end. Eat and get potato croquettes. Nice. God, I cannot imagine what level three gets like, man. That's stressful enough. <laughs> so many orders you gotta fill on top of giving special treatment to rare the rare customers. You gotta fulfill the needs of like the, the common folk. Oh my Jesus. Fucking wriggle, man. Gah. What a what a bastard. I should really take the staccatas off the menu since very rarely are they actually ordered. The debt is due in two days. Should save up those two days, don't buy too much, and then it's spending all my money. Misty, what's 
The matter is time to go collecting the honey and fresh fish today. All right, I'm coming right now. It would be nice if we collect some more late for you today. Cheer up, nothing can go wrong. Uh. Looking for a chef for cats. Chen is looking for a chef who can provide picnic food. Interested parties, please dis uh, visit Discuss. Help this yo th thoughtful young yokai. There's a l young yokai looking for someone who's good at cooking. If you would like to assist, please help him at the East Yokai Trail. Okay. Sure. Hmm. Why is there a computer at my... Welcome to the midst of collaboration tour. You can manage collaborations with other games. This is the setting menu for the collab. Three minutes is great. It's spelled with Japanese. You know, gonna be soft. The main story focuses on three fairs. Meet revenge stories. Uh, so place a nice kind of save point in the game. You can see the lovely store owner herself. You're interested, please consider purchasing the game. It's themed to try them. Rare customers, uh, along with special collaboration recipes and drinks. Would you like to achieve this collaboration event? Yes. Activate it if you want. You can deactivate it anytime. Enjoy the game. Three fairies begin to appear at Yokai Trail, Human Village. Yo oh, jeez. Fuck it everywhere, huh? I don't have Blooming Chaos 2. It's on my wish list. I've heard of that game. I haven't played it though. Nice. Alright. Wiggle, what's up? Nice timing, preparing for the Night of the Fireflies. Yeah, I don't know what you're... I gotta find a special flower for her, I guess. Yo! NPCs with different art style discovered! <laughs> ah, the nice sparrow yokai! You recognize me? I don't remember seeing such blocky creatures in our world. You're one to talk, you made of pixels too! Pixels? What are those? That doesn't matter, we've come through a link passage from another world. Another world, and what do you mean by passage? It means the people who made your bird brain, the ones who made us, created a different uh, passage that allows our worlds to collaborate. We came to the passage to come here to play, this world is also pretty fun. We heard that you open an izakaya here, right? We come to visit at night. At night, but I can't get my energy up at night. Lou and I will drag you along. What? No! It's too much of a hassle. I don't really get it, but if you come visit, I'll give you my best cooking. Yay, I feel sleepy at night, but I'll do my best to come. No matter how sleepy you feel, we'll still drag you along. You're welcome to visit our world through this passage. Yeah, our world has ample space for you to open an establishment anywhere without being chased by the law enforcement. And we beat up that shrine maiden long ago anyway. That's because she was holding back, I think. A win's a win! Hurry and check out the world! Three fairies hop and flap and great adventure! I'm eager to see what kind of establishment you'd open in our world. Definitely, I'll be there. Please look forward to it. A dreamy cake modeled after the hat of Scarlet Devil. Sweet jam oozes out like blood when cut. A rare dessert for the world of three fairies hop and great. Precious moose modeled after the hat of an unconscious yokai. Gaze into the infinite darkness while cutting it and let it etch an unforgettable taste in your very soul. A rare dessert from the <laughs> giant popsicle. Simple yet substantial lard, ice cubes, sweet and minty, revive you full HP in a hot summer day, a precious treat. Sure, why not? Thanks. <laughs> Are you the yokai kid who's looking to cook? Yeah, you here to mock me? Of course not, I was wondering how I may help you after reading your worrisome request in the newspaper. I appreciate it, but aren't you a yokai as well? You don't look like an experienced cook either. So I look like an amateur. Ouch! Even the youngest yokai don't take me seriously. Anyway, my mother was severely injured and had to stay in bed ever since. Now the chores all follow me. I can handle them no problem, but when it comes to cooking, my mother has a favorite dish. I believe she will get better sooner she could eat that thing again. Please, I don't know anything about cooking. Yesterday, some Tengu journalists passed by and heard my story. I see. Do you mind telling me more details about the dish? Maybe I could help. Maybe I don't look like a real cook, but I assure you that I am a real one. Then could you make grilled lamprey? Lamprey. Grilled lamprey. Yes, that's my mother's favorite food. I cannot find lampreys anywhere, nor replicate the taste that my mother likes. I'd be so grateful if you could teach me how to make that dish. Not gonna lie, but grilled lampreys is one of my signature dishes. Leave it to me, I know the recipe and have all the ingredients. Really, could I trust you? Let's say if I could be 100% certain of one thing in this world, it would be this. Please have some faith in me. I will, thank you. Give four grilled lamprey. Oh my god, alright. Look, I can barely afford any on my own, my own restaurant. All right, four of them, huh? Well, let's take a look around. I, I need to find Udambara. Ah, seaweed, shit. Hmm. Oh, the popsicle is a drink. <laughs> Jen! Uh, I'm so thirsty. Do you need to drink something? Ah, when did you show up? 
I thought cats were supposed to be sharp and always on high alert. I'm preparing for the Izakai tonight and I happened to run into you, so I came to say hello. Mmm, I watched that in your hand. Those wine bottles? I told you I was preparing for the Izakai tonight. Is there wine inside? Do you want some? You seem thirsty. Mmm, but what? Are you afraid of getting drunk? Well then, actually makes sense. Uh, wines have a pretty high alcohol content. I was originally thinking I should drink some stuff intended for customers, but since you asked, I'll take a bottle. Take a bottle, that's more like it. Here you go. Mm, yeah. Yeah, bad. <laughs> actually, wow. You finished the entire bottle. That was fast. This bottle is actually. Ah, oh, this wine is not as good as I shot. Um, compared to the wine I had uh, last time. Not even close! Is that for real? Your face is red. Sh- Shot! Oh! Can- Can I get one? One more bottle? For adults? <laughs> you look completely drunk. It's pretty good acting skills, I have to admit. Unfortunately, I know for sure that those wine bottles only have water inside. I didn't have enough water buckets, so I used wine bottles as a temporary container. Ah! Right? Right? This wine is so light. Almost like water. <laughs> me, me, me must attach, won't she? Attach, me watch. What? The, is she really drunk? Me, me must, uh, who? She's so late. I heard Nekomata a greater hypnosis that she subconsciously hypnotized herself that this is a strong liquor. It's <laughs> hilarious. Oi! Ah, you woke up? Ah, I told you to fetch a chicken, yeah. Yeah. Is she talking in her dream? What? What'd you fetch me a sparrow? She's still commanding others even in her dream. And you! Y yeah, you! Don't understand that? Go fetch me a big fat pig! Do I need to? I should be fine if I just leave her here. Huh. Who are you? Well, create something delicious! In that case, I'll play along this time. Chen, I saw your request in the Boom Boom Mario newspaper. Mind telling me more about it? You came? Or you're not open your ears to Kai anymore. It's still early in the day, I have some time left. Mmm, okay. Let me explain. My kitties usually exclusively live in the mountains. I want to give them something new, but having to pick the cure at the Yokai Trail. You are sure? You are such a nice owner. Of course, however, I can't prepare everything for the picnic, so... Don't worry about it, I'll take it from here. What do you want? Mmm, just, just, just mush me, not even mush, mush for one kitty. Please stop with the endless boasting. Didn't you say that you were going to cook something great? Well, do it. And then just stand there, do this, and nyat, and nyat. Oh, she's actually making something. Yeah, yeah, right. Don't no. yeah, yeah. What are you talking about? You told me you wanted pork. Mmm, that's true. Sh should yeah, yeah. Right, fishy smell. <laughs> you need fish? Fish. Ah, uh, yes, right. Yeah, go fish me a trout. She's still going. Oh, wow, well, shish. This is the fish, fish you wanted earlier. What fish? I'm in pork. <laughs> Watch me a big fat peg. I don't you go good job why are you crying? I can't believe a yokai can get drunk from water for so freaking long what in the world uh, I want to cook something delicious All right, all right. I'll give you both fish and pork. That's a lot of meat Are you finally done? D delicious It's me specialty dish. Ah, oh, surprising discovery after write it down But this dish might not have a strong fish smell, but I just left it like this. We still need a little improvement Got it this time. It's actually exists yokai who can get drunk from water. Running a catnip. So annoying. What's wrong? Wet cat? Oh. Okay. So what do you want from me exactly? Uh. Give three grilled to Chen. I don't know where that is. It's quietly blooming somewhere nearby. I need to give seven lamprey. Oh my god. Have Chen try out the pork and trout kebab. Oh no. Can you sell me some lamprey? <laughs> can you... Can you please sell me some lamprey? <laughs> Ruma? Rumi, I'm here to play with you again. What should we play? Fried lampreys. Oh, I don't have lampreys to fry! You decide? Let's play the game where we pretend we are crucified saints. What kind of game is that? A saints game? <laughs> no saint will want to play that. Is that so? 
Of course, you sometimes speak nonsense. Where'd you get that idea? I don't remember. I just fly around aimlessly. I land where I land. You're so stoic and carefree. Maybe it's a kind of philosophy. Maybe you do have the potential to become a saint. Is that so? However, I don't always fly aimlessly. Really? That's news to me. I mean, you are ranked number one in my head is completely empty list. I'm in first place. Not bad. That wasn't praise. <laughs> Who cares? An empty headed yokai and a bird brain yokai. Don't we have great synergy? Well, I may be a bird brain. At least I have something in my brain. Is that so? Of course. When I went to your Izakaya last time, I just realized that you hadn't made your signature fried lampreys for a while now. Why didn't you remind me earlier? I'll write it down immediately. See? Whose head is empty now? Okay. Uh, I want to guarantee... Let me see. I need to guarantee Rumia uh, and Chen come to try out the thing, but I need lampreys. Oh my god. How much lamprey do I have? 13. Oh no. That's got to go off the menu for the day. Str that just has to go off the menu. Okay, well, I need a. Uh... Okay. I need Rumia and, and Mistia to show up. Let me see the recipe. What do I need for it? Grilled lamprey. Not grilled. I need fried lamprey. And the. Okay. Trout and pork, that's pretty obvious. And then just lamprey again, so, with a frying pan. Okay, I need you to come along. Uh, apparently, that whatever that thing that is that Riggle's looking for is somewhere, but I have to find it. But I need lamprey. And now I'm, like, out of time for the day. Hmm. It's rare. Somewhere nearby. I have no idea though. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> I need lamprey. They don't sell it though, so I need to go fish it out of the ocean. Or the river. Trout, lamprey, trout. I need seven total cooked. Oh, man. Okay, there's some. I actually can't put it on the menu. Trout. Lamprey. Can I activate the Blooming Chaos collab without the game? Uh, I'll hold off on that for now. Just because I'm not familiar with that game, like, at all. But I am familiar with the other one. I don't want to add too many different elements all at once. Okay. Um, we'll do level two, but I can't, I can't put my signature dish on the menu. This is going to be really weird. Oh man. It's, looks like it's a, uh, it's bargain night at Mistia's. <laughs> I can make a lot of those. Okay. I, oh, hold on. I can't. I can't run. Oh, I can't run all of this at the same time. I, can't, I just can't. I don't have the. Let's let's do frying pan steamer. Okay. Frying pan steamer. Okay. Okay. That's. That's fine. Popsicles. <laughs> Stimulating. No alcohol. Okay. God, I wish I had more cutting boards. Alright. Yep. Yeah. Saw a lot, of, a lot of potatoes today. No lamprey on the menu. This is a crime. But I just don't... I can't afford it. Oh, right, 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 right. What was it? Ruma wanted the grilled lamprey. And Ruma... No, not Ruma. Uh, what did Ruma... Yes, no, Ruma wanted that. Ruma wanted the grilled lamprey, which is just frying pan with the, the lamprey. Ooh. 
Oops. And Chen wanted the the skewer with the the pork and fish. Yep. Okay. I held that. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Here you go. Okay, prep has been taken care of. I know that the the intended targets will be coming. Okay. Save the backup food for when it gets busy. Okay. Whoosh. Won't be very high. Well, if somebody wants this... I can make some big money off of that. Three fairy. Ooh. They're here! My friends! <laughs> they came as a group. Are they all gonna share a seat? <laughs> okay. I want fungus cuisine. I want a bitter beverage. Fungus. Which one was mushrooms? Roasted mushroom was grilled mushroom. Crab? Where did I get a crab? Eight-legged fool thinks it can scurry around with its armored shell by simply steaming it. It can be turned to the ultimate delicacy. Just be careful of those pincers. Bitter. Hoosh. Okay. <laughs> Did the three fairies like it? It was so and so. Okay. They didn't- they didn't hate it. Okay. Can I grab from the front? Oh yeah, I can. Oh god, it's Riggle. Riggle is great for business, but my god! Does she make it hell on earth in this establishment? Table five. Okay. What do you want, Regal? Abnormal food, low alcohol. Okay. Wait, what did I have to give Regal again? Uh, it wasn't Regal I was giving something to. Never mind. Abnormal food. Abnormal food. Sweet raw meat. What do you want again? Low alcohol beverage. Okay. Firefly phenomenon. Rice ball. Seafood. There's Ruma.
Table three. Carnivore, low alcohol beverage. Same deal. Low alcohol beverage. Okay. Okay. Five. Wriggle. Can't go with a full stomach and a soda beverage. Okay. Fried lampreys. Soda beverage. Okay. Cutting boards, cutting boards, cutting boards. It's rice ball night. <laughs> it's rice ball night. Sweet dish, iceable beverage. Iceable. Iceable, iceable. Iceable. All right, Regal. You're paying the big bucks right now. Whoosh. Nice. Another rice ball. Where's Chen? Whoosh. Another rice ball. Oh, come on now. Where's Chen? Insects, carnivores. I didn't catch that last bit. Low alcohol beverage. Insects, carnivores. No, 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 no. Low alcohol. Whoosh. Where's Chen? Uh, what did I just do? Wow, that was a cool order of buttons I definitely hit. Threw it out. Let's be more careful about that in the future, I suppose. I made my skewer for nothing! Okay. No one wanted an egg at all. Wait. Whoops. Why do you all want rice balls? Why are you all so cheap? I actually just ate through my seaweed stock, huh? I invited Chen and she didn't show up. Some friend? What the fuck? <laughs> Go home. Store's closed. Take it and get. 
Beat it. Shoo. Vamos. Leave. Leave. There you go. Little movement speed went up. <laughs> oh, nobody wanted the eggs at all, and I had an extra seaweed dish in there. Damn. Why do nobody wants that goddamn egg? And I had to ditch the, to ditch the skewer, because she didn't show up. Thought we were friends, Chen. Humans are unbearable. Insect delivery service teams looking for a chef to assist their mission. Yeah, okay. I have to cook a million lampreys. Ah. Uh... All oh, right, I forgot album. Three fairies. <laughs> Hi, heroines from the three fairies hop and flap and great journey. They travel here via the gate of collaboration. Uh, their endless curiosity and energy made them quite popular in this world as well. Just seeing them hopping around makes me happy for an entire day. Their budget is pitiful. They like bitter and fungus, but not hot. Okay. There they are, though. Alright. Oh, Chen does not like strange foods. I didn't mean to... I didn't... I didn't think I gave her a strange food, though. Huh. Alright. Alright, what do you want, Riggle? Missed you came! I knew of you the one coming, I wouldn't even bother posting in the newspaper. Well, it's pretty interesting. Your newspaper mentioned you needed some assistance or something. You know, I created a buggy notification, right? I wanted to terminate the service, but we still have leftover assignments. So I want to reassign them to somebody else. Uh, can a service commanding bugs really be profitable? Of course! Buggy notification actually has a pretty good customer review. Really? So what do you need help with? Our service team accepted a request to remind someone to eat the appropriate hours. My lovely insects also provided a free delivery service, but the customer complained that the food was wasted due to bug infestations. He's also asking for compensation. Humans are really ridiculous. Why would anyone set a reminder for their meals? Also, it looks like your service is completely rejected by customers. Hmm. Those mere pesky humans look down on us as insects. I don't even want to deal with them. Anyway, you need a new meal, right? I'll help. What do you need? Give three to Chen. Give two do runny eggs. Oh god. Alright. Oh, this is gonna be one of those days. Alright. I don't need do. I need to buy seaweed. This is gonna be I'm cooking in my shed for the day. That's all. Chen, you better fucking come out today. Man, I have to give you something. Give me all your seaweed, please. Give me all your chili peppers. Okay, give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me all that. Give me that. I don't need that, actually. Give me that. All right. Yes. Romeo, when did you realize that fried lampreys weren't on the menu? When did I realize? I don't remember. I mean, if you realized that, you should have told me immediately. Why? W why? I mean, we are friends after all. Is that so? <laughs> of course! You should give me a positive answer. Of course we are friends. We are friends! Romeo, ever felt that you, we weren't taken seriously recently? Just recently? I haven't been attacked a human for a while now. Just the other day, a group of humans started shouting, Don't come here, and started attacking me! You had it worse than I did. Nobody would be scared of you if they see you, right? Is that so? That's right. Speaking of that, both of our abilities to take people's vision away, and we attack them when they are vulnerable. Mm, should we get together and play some tricks on some humans at night? Eh? Then I'll have to move. Don't make me move. I picked up these on the ground. They look edible. You shouldn't eat everything you find on the ground. Is that so? You need at least to clean it and cook it thoroughly. That's too much trouble. I don't want it anymore. You can take it. Yo, you found a pumpkin? Nice. I dig the pumpkin. Alright, time to cook. I need two runny eggs and seven... Seven grilled lampreys. Do I have enough time for that in the day? Let's see. I sure do. And time has just flown by. Alright, Riggle. 
Have you considered bugs as pests? They don't shed at all. Wiggly, you look very decently. Right, I still haven't found the, uh... Still haven't found the flower. Have a look, is this it? That aroma and the soft crust that puffs just right, my mother will absolutely love it, thank you so much. Great, I'm always glad to help, but I don't have much to give you. Let me see what I have here. I was searching for food, I climbed the cliff and actually found a very beautiful flower. I stumbled to the ground, seeing it blossom. This is yours now, I hope you accept it. This is a legendary flower. If I use this as an ingredient, I wonder what miracles could happen. Good luck, thanks, I'll always remember you. Yo, he found the Udumbada Badoobly. He's got it. Nice. There it is. The miraculous flower that grows in this marsh is very precious. Legendary, dreamy, wonderful, premium. Uh, what else did he find? Ramuni. It's a drink, right? Drink with a magical marble. Push the marble into the drink. It'll cause the drink to violently carbonate. Drink it all. The fizzing cold bubbles in one go and you'll feel your entire summer in your stomach. Neat. Well, now I can give that to Riggle. There you go, Riggle. This is... Found it on a hill. I've never seen a flower as graceful and... Uh... Uh... Elegant into my life. I thought that someone as knowledgeable as you probably know something about this flower, so here you go. Wow, your eyes, are they swollen all of a sudden? My apologies, I didn't expect to see the flower of our race once again. Hold on a sec, you mean this is... Right? It's the um, Dumbara indeed. How are you and tell me where did you find it again? It's on a small hill towards the end of the Yokai Trail. Jack, write that down. It was here? So it was right under my nose all along. So this is the fabled Udumbara with the flower. I can finally make the Udumbara cake. Well, look who still remembers. I don't mean to brag, but my bird brain will memorize anything that is slightly related to cooking. Not to mention that it's also the wish of my best buddy. Just you wait. Alright, so now I have to feed her. A small hill, huh? That must be the area behind Ruma. Oh, nice. More stinky liquor. Thank you, my kitties really enjoy those dishes. By the way, shouldn't you be opening Izukai right about now? I'm going, I'm going. Heartwarming helper. I did it. See, so you hear me call. Oh, come to my establishment. You gotta come to my club. Come to my club. What do we add anyway? Uh, three more things I can do. I need to talk to Wriggle. All right, I have to give her the, the cake first. I'm not making that until she actually shows up at my establishment, though. That's a rare ingredient. And I assume it's found up here. A small hill, huh? That's a potato. Uh, have her try out the cake, and then have Chen try that out and pay the... Th one day. One day. Hold on, I want the- I need a liquor. Fuck, I haven't been able to replenish that in a while. Oh, there it is! Oh, I see it! How do I get up there, though? I don't think I can get up there. Huh. No, I think I need access to the next area before I can do that. <laughs> I only got it as a quest. A quest item, but I see the flower now. Okay. Damn it, just trout. Okay. Fuck, I need seaweed, don't I? Alright. Oh boy, what's my menu looking at? Oh, not good. Uh, let's see. Uh, <laughs> boiled tofu, rice ball, runny egg, dried fish, croquet. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, I got this now. Umeshu. Home brewed plum wine from the human village. Sweetness hides the alcohol content. Amateurs often pass that without even realizing it. Okay. All right. I am ready to go. Okay, I didn't invite Riggle, but she should just show up anyway. But let me just double check. The recipe for the cake is dew and the flour in the in the steamer, and that's it. Okay. All 
All right. You know they're gonna want rice balls as the prime delivery. What? Okay. There we go. Oh, nice. Whoosh. Surplus has been made. Let's hope I don't forget about it. I remember when I had seaweed. That was a good time. Good time in my life. Alright. Now here I stand. Wait till it gets busy. I'm waiting for Wriggle, basically. Oh, now they're gonna finish their food faster. Oh, shit. There's Ruma. What do you want, Ruma? Full stomach soda beverage. Filling his rice ball. Rice ball is considered filling, right? Yeah. Uh, what was she at? So, yeah, raw, raw meat, strange filling. Raw, strange meat. The Ruma rice ball. Uh, soda beverage. Okay. Thirty. Soda, soda, soda. Get one of these, I guess. Okay. Nice. Alright. Free ingredients. Gotta love it. Bitter, full stomach. Make the same thing then. Okay. Raw, strange meat. Okay. I said bitter, right? Bitter beverage. No. Bitter, bitter, bitter. Bitter, 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 bitter. Bitter. What's bitter? What's bitter? What's bitter? You're not bitter, you're dry. You're bitter. There we go. Okay. There's Regal. Uh in the steamer, in the steamer. Expensive, sweet, no meat, not aquatic, legendary, uh, photogenic. I can make it strange and raw, right? Strange raw. Let me just find out what she wants first. I mean, I know what she wants. It doesn't matter. All right, Wriggle. Abnormal food. Okay, that's fine then. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What did Wriggle want again? Iceable beverage. You know what's iceable? The expensive shit. Hope you like it. No. 
No, wait, Riggle, I wasn't ready for this. Business is booming. Oh, oh. Wow. Wow. Okay. More rice balls. Number two. All the fairies are here. Oh no. Oh my god, everybody wants a fucking rice ball. Looks like I got a new special on the menu. I want a small portion cuisine and a sweet beverage. Small portion cuisine, huh? Okay. Small portion, small portion cuisine. What's a small portion? They like, they like fungal, right? Small portion, that's dried sardines, right? Small portion, salty, it's not bitter. So I give them that with, uh, with the mushroom. Savory, vegetarian, fungus. Does that work? I guess. And a sweet beverage. Okay. Sweet. Um, I bet they like the popsicles. Here, take it. They love it! <laughs> they love me! Oh god, time for rice ball hell. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Table one. One, two, three. Look how small they are though. They're so tiny. This is where the line starts. Closing time. Ho ho ho. There you go. Number four. Dude, when they eat, when they have Totetsu fever and they just fucking vacuum their food, it is so hard to keep up with it all. <laughs> well, that was so good, I think I'll have it a second time. Dude, it's just, it's just rice balls. Take it. Holy shit, someone wants not rice balls. Do I have that in the storage? No, I don't. Nobody wants the goddamn runny egg. Riggle, your recipes suck. Wow. Oosh. Okay. Okay. It doesn't end! Whoosh! Ah! Oh. Done! And now I just wait for Misty to retrieve the drinks. Okay. Oh, right on time. Tonkatsu ramen.
That sounds pretty good. Oh, yo, yo, Nobody wants the eggs. The fairies love the popsicle as a drink, apparently. I sold a, I sold a potato croquet, at least. That's it, though. That's it. Objective one completed. I, my kneecaps, my kneecaps are saved. Oh. Uh. Fungus, small portion. The friendship. Okay. Well. Wait, isn't today the day I pay my debts? Do I pay my dues? Is it over for me? Regal, how was the you dumb bar a cake the other day? Great work. Tasted so perfect that it was I was in tears. Oh, isn't that a little over exaggerated? You don't buy a cake that serves all the compliments it can get. You know Chen didn't show up again? Okay. You wouldn't get it. It's not only a cake, but also a symbol of our glorious past. I felt that I might be able to revive the insect race when I saw the blossom. I'm sorry I didn't mean know it means that much to you. No worries. Do you know the meaning behind you dumb bar? An unwavering future. <clears throat> About beverages. Oh, she can find drinks now. How's your business going? Compliments are piling through the roof. For real, I told you don't underestimate us insects. Tell you the truth, I'm quite impressed. It's nothing though, ever on second thought. Eh, why do we need insects to serve humans in the first place? It was never on my objectives, therefore I have decided to quit! You got bored of it, didn't ya? So now she can find me beverages. Riggle was my best friend. No matter how hard I try to be friends with, with Chen though. Alright, check out our world. We're gonna see what kind of establishment you opened up. No, give me those. Giant popsicle. Ten sparrow socket. That shit has been fermenting, baby. It's kind of a weird spot for that. Get some dew. What am I hurting on? Uh, still lamprey, huh? Makes sense. Will Chen ever visit my house? New products. I actually gotta buy seaweed. It's crazy. Give me all your meat. I should be fine. How goes, Ruma? Why is the grass dying around here? Ah, about that. It's because I live here. Ah. Mm, it's also because I live here a little too long. What do you mean? I don't understand you at all. What does living here have to do with the grass dying? Because it's too bright here, so I kept the area around me in total darkness. And then? Because plants need sunlight in order to... Ah, now I understand. Turns out you are a pest. First of all, rude? Second of all, yeah. Alright. Okay, chat, I really want to see how this concludes, but it's late. It's so late. I got I got a blue ball, yeah. Oh, whoops. It's closing time. I gotta I gotta stop here. Wait, how do you... S okay, so the game just saved. Oh, wait. Everything I just did is gonna be undone then, huh? Well, that was kind of pointless. <laughs> I forgot about that. The game saves every at the end of every day. I gotta... I gotta quit out. How do I do that? The X button? RT? Back to main menu, please. Hmm... There you go. So yeah, that was uh, that was addictive, to say the least. Uh, five hours. Uh, so next time I play, I just gotta do one more trip at the Izakaya, and then, then I can you know pay back my debt. Amazing. Good start for a game. Very 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 addictive game. Oh God, I might. Oh hi Jun. I might play that. Uh, you know. But not tomorrow, but like, you know, I might play that, I might play that real early. <laughs> I might play that real early in the week again, I suppose. I really want to play more of it. It was a lot of fun. And, you know, I'm interested in everything that's happening with it, for sure. Monday? Maybe even earlier than that. What is today? Thursday? 
Yeah, today's Thursday. Oh my god. I don't know. Uh, I, 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 I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't expect it to be that good. Like I knew it was gonna be pretty good based on the ratings, but I didn't think it was gonna be. Oh shit! I want to keep playing anyway. Five hours later, and I still want to play, but I have to stop. This isn't. This isn't a moment of I don't want to play anymore. This is a moment of I have to cut myself off because <laughs> I'm not going to stop if I don't cut myself off here. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna. Play more of that later in the week for sure. 100%. Expect it. Count on it. Look forward to it.